What's up y'all, I'm Jordy, and today I'm going to be sharing the battles from a Hoenn tournament that I participated in, uh, and that I did pretty well in if I do say so myself. Uh, the idea behind this tournament is that it's the Emerald decks, the Emerald regional decks only. So it includes basically the Hoenn Pokemon that are in Scarlet and Violet, and a couple other things like you see Raichu and Gyarados here. Uh, Groudon, Kyogre, Rayquaza are all banned, this isn't going to be a Regulation G tournament. Uh, it's Regulation F, but stuff like Latios is allowed, along with like the Regis. Uh, but anyway, the general idea of my team was set up screens with Sableye, and then either set up with Gyarados, or just throw out big damage with Latios and Metagross. Uh, I've also got on this team a lot of wit partners for Metagross to Earthquake next to, because I've gone Terra Ground Earthquake. So Gardevoir's Telepathy, Gyarados Flying type, Latios' Levitate, when it's not turned off by Weezing or something. Uh, can all ignore the Earthquake. Uh, I've also got a support Raichu here. It's a good combo with Gyarados with Fake Out and Encore, so if they try to protect from the Fake Out, they can get Encored into that. Gardevoir here is specifically an answer to Trick Room. I have Terra Ghost to ignore Fake Outs, and then Taunt to shut down Dust Clabs. And I've also gone with a defensive set with Life Dew to heal up a little bit since I'm going to be behind screens. The Latio set is also a little bit weird because I have Weather Ball to pair with Sableye's Sunny Day, which can rip Metagrosses and Registeels apart. Uh, just a little sneaky tech I got on there. But anyways, let's jump right on into this. Alright, here we go. Uh, I got a lead Gardevoir for Taunt, uh, because they're gonna try to fake out and set up Trick Room potentially. They could also try to Spore and set Trick Room, but I'm not gonna allow that either. Uh, so I need Gardevoir and I need Terra. It could be next to Metagross, which is hard for me to knock out. Um, I want Sableye in the back in case they want to like explode with Metagross for whatever reason. Don't think they would do that, but just in case. I'm wondering if I want to lead Raichu. Because Raichu could like throw a fake out, like if they lead Breloom, but that's Terra Ghost. Um, uh, I could just lead Latios and try to do some damage, but if it's Metagross, that'll be harder to do. I could go Gyarados. Uh, I don't know the lead. I know Sableye, Latios are coming. For sure. Just don't know the fourth and what one is going to be in lead. Uh, maybe I lead Gyarados just to get an Intimidate down on Breloom or Hariyama. It can also resist Torkoal, but I'm not going to have Terra for it. So I think I want to lead Latios, and then have Sableye, Metagross in the back. Yes. Okay, <laughs> that's what I'm going with. Uh, maybe it could be Gyarados. Uh, I don't see them not bringing Torkoal though, and if I'm fighting in the sun, and I want to Terra Gardevoir maybe, I don't know. I mean, there's no guarantee I have to tear at Gardevoir. It really depends on their lead. So we'll see. Alright, we've got... Dusclops Hariyama. Hariyama is Fake Out Facade Close Combat Wide Guard. And Dusclops is Trick Room Willow Sunny Day Nightshade. So all they can do is Nightshade if I Terra Ghost taunt them. Terra Ghost, Taunt the Dusclops, and then like, yeah, they could hit my Latios with Fake Out, maybe Facade this turn. Uh, I think I'm happy to throw a Luster Purge at their Hariyama though. Just in case they like go for something else or go for a swap there. But I think, yeah, I think they might waste their fake out into Gardevoir trying to stop the taunt. So I want to go for the Terra Ghost. Maybe game two we can think of a different plan. But stopping Trick Room has to be priority number one. Fake out into Latios, that's perfectly okay. Because we get the taunt, and do they go for Nightshade? Uh, do they know what was about to happen there? They do. Okay. Perfectly fair. No, 
Now I think it's time to make Hariyama useless and just double down into Dust Claps. Shadow Ball should cover any swap from Dust Claps. And I can go into Sableye now and start setting up my screens. <laughs> and because of their Hariyama set, Fake Out Facade, Close Combat, Wide Guard, they can't touch me if I have two ghosts on the field. So that's what I mean by making Hariyama useless. Hariyama could swap here as well. I could also see it going Terra Steel to take the uh, Luster Purge. Because that's basically a free slot shot. Luster Purge and uh, Moonblast into that slot. And they do go for a Terra. Cool. I'm glad to see that. Into Steel. Yeah, because then there was really no way for me to hit them other than like Shadow Ball and Draco, which... Maybe the combo does it, but I don't care. I can deal with them later. I'd rather hit Dust Claps for a bit. How much? Decent chunk. Dust Claps is so bulky. Alright, yep. Facade does not affect Sableye. Excellent. And then Nightshade in the guard. Cool. Now, who do you swap your Hariyama to? You probably have Torkoal. And I would guess Metagross. I like a Shadow Ball into Hariyama and a Foul Play into Hariyama. That would cover pretty much anything. I don't really need a screen yet, yeah. Hariyama does swap. Who did I catch? Show me something good. Breloom. I love doubling into Breloom. I don't think I get the KO, but Gardevoir should be faster anyway, so I can finish it off later. Ooh, big damage. That might be foul play range. That thing has a big attack stat. Yeah, get out of here, Breloom. Woo! Bye-bye. How's that taunt going on dust maps? If they're, if they're almost out of taunt range, uh, out of taunt, that's annoying. Alrighty. Dust Claps does shake off the taunt. Okay. Gonna have to put that back up. And here's Torkoal. Eruption, Heat Wave, Weather Ball, Clear Smog. I could easily taunt Dusclops. But Torkoal doesn't have... Protect. <clears throat> Do I want to target Torkoal down? Ooh, this is a hard position. No, I think taunt Dusclops is better. And just put up light screen. Ah, Dusclops swap. Good play. Really good play. I was so worried about a Torkoal swap. And now if you can take out my ghosts, and then you can get a fake out turn, you're in a pretty good spot. I can't wide guard, but that's not really going to matter. Sableye does hang on, that's good. Probably go Latios here just because it has protect. Um, would they try to get Dust Claps back in? I don't know. I'll protect Latios. I could go for foul play onto Hariyama. Or I could set up Reflect. Which do I think would be more impactful? I think Latios probably goes down anyway. Yeah, I don't think Reflect is going to change the calcs much. I want to throw a foul play at Hariyama. While I still can. Most likely it's just a fake out into Latios. Yeah. That's cool with me. How much does this do? Oh, an amazing chunk. That's perfect. That's exactly what I need. Because now I can... 
Oh, they st if they're still taunted, I can bring in Metagross and just Earthquake, Monster Purge. GG. Right? Because that's definitely Earthquake range on Hariyama. Hurt by its burn, still taunted. Great. Unfortunate that I had to reveal Metagross. Alright, Hariyama is still taunted for one more turn. Perfect. So Luster Purge into Torkoal plus Earthquake. They are Charcoal. That should be enough. By my estimation, that's plenty. Alright. Duskloud could switch into either slot here. I think getting Hariyama out makes some sense. Torkoal is the one who's really going to be doing the damage. So it's hard to say. You're, you're definitely going to lose something this turn. Maybe both things, if this can do it. Oh yeah, that's plenty of damage. Well done, Latios. An Earthquake should clear the board, leaving just Dust Clouds, which cannot win on its own. GG. Alright. A good game one, but a scary one. Uh, I don't think the exact same plan is going to work again. Because there's other ways they could go, you know? Um, let's see. Getting rid of Bal Baloom on that swap was big, too. Baloom could be annoying with Focus Ash and Spore. I'm just gonna go for the accurate moves of... Monster Purge is 95 with Stab, which is 150. Mother Ball's a little stronger. And Heavy Slam. I just don't want to miss Draco. Yeah, that's plenty of damage. Cool. Alright. Good game one. Uh, definitely could go not my way if I'm not careful. So while well, that's a solid game one for my team, uh, we'll see what happens in game two. Alright, here we are in game two. I kinda have to do Gardevoir again. But I'm worried about what they might do, because something like Torkoal Hariyama could just get a fake out off and then a big fire move. I'm wondering... Because then Latios would have to protect, and then... Yeah. I'm wondering if I want to lead Sableye Gardevoir instead of Latios Gardevoir just to be Im completely immune to fake out turn one. Uh, Hariyama might be dropped entirely, though, is another consideration. Um, I think I should go the same way. I think these four are perfectly solid. Like I said before, Gyarados, while it feels good here, if I can Terra it, I don't think I can. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to let them adapt. And if they can successfully adapt to this strategy, then I'm going to have to find another thing to do. Thing is, Torkoal goes down to a Draco, so they got to be really careful there. So, we'll see. Salamence Metagross, that's a total changeup. Explosion, Bullet Punch, Meteor Mash, Psychic Fangs, and Air Slash Draco Protect Roost. Not a whole lot that threatens my Metagross if I bring that in. And I'll just protect my Latios this first turn. I definitely don't want to get caught by, like, an ex a Terranormal Explosion. Which is what they have. Uh, with Bullet Punch, Meteor Mash, Psychic Fangs, any of that, my Metagross is okay. And plus being able to see what they lock into would be huge. Uh, I kinda wish I could get Sun- oh, they're going for a Terra, cool. Let me see, is it Double Steals? Yeah, Double Steals in front of my Latios. I really wish I had Sun. Probably get Latios out try to put Sun up. Let's see what they 
lock into on Metagross. Uh, locking into Bullet Punch. No, you're swapping out hard. You're definitely out of here. Uh, critical hit Bullet Punch, even. And then an air slash. Fine. Fine by me. I think their Metagross is going to swap. And so I want to throw a Psychic Fang at that. Meanwhile, Latios, I'll get out to save a lot because I need Sun before Latios can do anything to this team. But this Latios can do a lot of damage to their team once Sun goes up. And I think Sableye's a safe swap in. Yeah, Metagross is swapping. Show me something I can hit hard. Dust Pops, eh, it's fine. Could be worse. Draco Meteor. Which we eat, perfect. Psychic Fangs does not do nearly enough. Torkoal's coming in and they're setting Trick Room. Right. That's gotta be what happens here. It's gotta be. Oh, it's not what's happening here. Alright, well, I'm getting a big earthquake off at least. That's pretty good. And Torkoal not coming in on a turn one of Trick Room is also nice. Um, unless I KO the Salamence, which, I mean, maybe. I don't know, it seems like a bulky Salamence. Half a Draco into Latios, that hurts a lot. Ooh, and I do KO Salamence, which actually might work against me. That could actually be pretty bad. Because now Torkoal can come in basically for free. I imagine you double into Metagross as well. Um, if I get Light Screen up, can Metagross win? Maybe. try to give them my Gardevoir and protect. Yeah, this is a bad position. Oh boy. Oh, coming in on that Draco, KOing their Salamence when it was at minus four. Yeah, I messed up there. Yeah, definitely Eruption. No question there. Uh, can Gardevoir take that? It's probably just going to be a follow-up anyway. Yeah, Gardevoir takes that, actually. Night Shade finish us off? Should do it. 45 HP. No, it's a Will-O-Wisp! Okay. And Gardevoir dodges anyway. I will try to Life Dew, and, which won't happen. They're gonna erupt. Um, no. If they let me get a move off, I should get my move off. They're not going to let me get a move off, I'm guessing. Really, my only chance is Metagross, and Metagross, uh, not looking too hot. I can get Light Screen up, I have Assault Vest, but I already, they already, I already dodged one Will-O-Wisp to dodge another. 
and isn't even enough damage into Torkoal anyway. Two turns of Trick Room. Yeah, they got this one. Light Screen. Earthquake. Sorry, Sableye. That's how it's gotta be. And I don't think I take the double up anyway, even if they do just go for light. Ooh, no, I would live a night a Nightshade, actually. Interesting. But now a single target eruption, or... Oh, do I dodge? Oh, Metagross! Metagross, let's go! Uh, I don't think I owe Kotorkoal anyway. Nope. Last turn of Trick Room, too. Ah. I'll try Bullet Punch Dusclops. Not gonna be enough, probably. Oh, <laughs> yeah, lives on one. Okay, good game. Okay. Salamence, Metagross, Dusclops, Torkoal. How shall I do the handling that? They led Double Steel to scare out Gardevoir. Hmm. Alright. I lost because they got Trick Room up. And I wasn't ready. I think this time a Sableye lead is solid. No matter what they lead, Sableye is pretty solid. And then I do want to lead Gardevoir. I just have to be careful about them pivoting around and getting Dusclops in to get Trick Room. And then maybe Latios Metagross in the back. Raichu with Sash isn't that powerful, honestly. Gyarados is okay, but in the sun it's going to do very little, and they will wisp Dusclops. I think Metagross is just better. Despite its problems. So yeah. Those are the four. That's my new order. We'll see how it goes. They swapped Metagross. Huh. Gotta get Gardevoir in at the right time. I cannot let Trick Room go up. I cannot. Because Torkoal, as we've seen, can sweep me. If Trick Room's up. Metagross Dustbox. Cool combo. Choice Band Heavy Slam definitely takes Gardevoir, even through Terra. But not through Reflect and Terra. Oh, and they have Meteor Mash too, which is much weaker. Oh, I guess they could Psychic Fangs. That's what I'm doing. Dusclop swap! No! Into Mets. Alright. At least I'm getting my screens up. Uh, it looks like they're not gonna try to explode at least. Uh, and I should be able to take a hit. I'm pretty sure I live Psychic Fangs with Choice Band, even because it breaks through my- oh, Paranormal, nice. Worried about a uh, Foul Play or a Shadow Ball, I guess. What if they just explode? That would be hilarious. That doesn't make any sense, though. Probably Psychic Fangs and- uh, Psychic Fangs into Gardevoir is risky. Uh, at least Taunt the Salamence. Making it a bit of a sitting duck. And it's just Meteor Mash, that's good. We- OH NO IT'S A CRIT, THAT'S BAD! Oh, that might be game over. Right there, just GG's. Huh. Well then. I'm gonna bring in Metagross. Oh boy. Oh, that's really bad. Uh, Metagross 
Heavy Slam into Salamence is max power. Good to know. They are Rocky Helmet. They are also pretty unthreatening for the most part. Uh, I guess I set Light Screen. Psychic Fangs, they're Metagross. Yeah, here comes Dusclops. Not cool. Do the Meteor Mash into Sableye, which does way too much damage as well. Just absurd amount of damage. Gonna be a Meteor Mash into Sableye slot. Most likely. I'm gonna see what I can do to their dust box. Meteor Mash does have a chance to miss, there we go. And we see that they're actually faster than my Metagross. Good damage into the Dust Clouds there. Who knows, that's true. Okay. Let's go for a foul play on their Metagross, which might clean it. Dust Collapse, Trick Room, Will O Wisp, Sunny Day, Nightshade. Let's not get Willowed right now. Let's go to Latios here. I don't think a Me Meteor Mash would come to that slot. I would swap before their Metagross, if they were going for something there. Uh, but Latios behind Light Screen, I think we can actually take a hit from Torkoal. And Sableye should be going before their Metagross, which is good. I don't think we KO from here. It might be close. That's fine, stalls another trick room turn. Alright, here's Metagross. Earthquake should Earthquake should be able to finish off their Metagross. Even if we're burned? I don't know. I'll go Psychic Fangs into their Metagross. Luster Purge Dusclops. Dusclops is gonna move first anyway. Yeah, I'm not confident in Earthquake KOing their Metagross after a burn. I need to go for as much damage as I can there. Ugh. Alright, this is a tough one. There goes Metagross, that's good. There's no way I win this though. Oh man, this is a good game. That huge crit on the Guard of War though. Wow. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Alright, let's see it. Bring out the torque. And the Salamence. Salamence definitely slower than my Latios. Torkoal definitely gonna obliterate my Metagross. damage I can do to Torkoal, if I somehow live. 
I think I need to double protect and get out of Trick Room. I think that's really my only way. If I get out of Trick Room, then I can be faster than Salamence. Don't think I take Eruption either way. Oh, Metagross does take Eruption. That's pretty cool. Weakens their eruption a bit. That's good. And Draco. Okay, do I rely more on a Draco dodge? Or the double protect? Or the double protect and Draco dodge? Double protect and Draco dodge combined is pretty good. Bullet punch just do a little more to Torpol. Go for the double on Latios. Which we get! Hold up, <laughs> it ain't over. Now the question is, do they protect Salamence? And I have to get it right. Unless I can take two eruptions behind light screen. That might be better. I think they protect Salamence. I think they protect Salamence. Protect your Salamence. Yes! Yes, I'm still in it. Hit the Draco. Yes! Hold up, it ain't over. It ain't over for Latios. A minus two Draco should be able to pick up Salamence. Unless they're extremely bulky. Come on, Latios, you got this. You got this. You so got this. Oh my god. A critical hit. Oh no! No! Alright, here we are, round two. Um, that is a Leftovers Iron Defense, Terra Ground Stomping Tantrum Metagross, Chlorophyll Tailwind Shift Tree with Fake Out, Hariyama with Fake, with no Fake Out, Detect Brick Break Facade, Knock Off, Terra Normal. The Gyarados is weird, Dragon Dance Avalanche, Thunder Wave, Temper Flare, Torkoal is pretty normal Torkoal, Terra Grass though, uh, and a Life Orb Dragon Dance Salamence. Okay, um, uh, I think my play is screens, uh, their Metagross doesn't have a way to break screens, uh, they do have Brick Break Hariyama though, and Knock Off on Hariyama, Hariyama's scary, uh, and they also have a lot of Fake Out, well they have one Fake Out actually, I thought, so keep thinking they have two, they don't, um, Latios is strong, Shift Tree's Clear Amulet, interesting. Citrus, Charcoal, Life Orb. I could set up with Gyarados. I don't like, I don't hate Gyarados set up. Set up with Gyarados, have Latios, and I'm kind of leaning Raichu in the back over Metagross. I don't know, Metagross might have been the play. It's just their Gyarados has a fire move, their Torkoal is there, their Salamence has Shadow Claw, Hariyama has Knock Off, Shiftry has Sucker Punch, their Metagross has Terra Ground Stomping Tantrum. Lots of stuff that hits Metagross. Aw, oh, cool, a Charizard! Neat. Alright, let's see what they got. 
Torkoal Shift Tree. Not crazy. Alright, it's gonna be hard for Torkoal to do any damage to my Gyarados. Shift Tree sure can, though, with Sucker Punch, Leaf Blade, Fake Out. So I kind of want to set up Reflect instead of Light Screen, but I need to set Light Screen first, I think. Um, yeah, I could Light Screen Protect. That's fine. No Terra comes out from anybody yet. They are Grass on Torkoal, Shiftry does Fake Out, cool. Poison on Shiftry. Just want my light screen up. I'm not asking for a lot. They are charcoal, tor charcoal, charcoal. Yep, yeah, there's the eruption. They knew they'd get that for free. It's gonna hurt do most of Sableye's health, but not all of it. So I can set up reflect. Probably get Leaf Blade erupted. Probably okay. Reflect. I could go straight for Terra Blast here, or I could Dragon Dance. I'm gonna go for Dragon Dance. Oh, it is a Sucker Punch! Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright, they were expecting the Terra Blast, I guess. Okay. I'm just a heat wave in front. Okay, they expected to probably get hit. No such luck. Alright, Sableye, you did your job. You set up the screens, and now we can start going crazy. Um, Shift Tree does not... Okay, it has Clear Amulet, Terra Poison, no Protect. So I can get a free fake out if I want it. And I think I do want it. Let's go right to the Cherished. I guess I'll just waterfall the total. I don't know, is that a mistake? Okay, just a swap from Shift Tree. Into Salamence, fine. Life Orb, Salamence, Dual Wing Beat, Dragon Claw, Shadow Claw. And to protect from Torkoal. Interesting. I can encore you into that. That's great. So Torkoal's locked. I can start punching Salamence. Encore. Got my plus one attack. Terra Blast the Mints. Here we go. That's the power of fake out encore though. Cause like you, you kinda wanna protect on the fake out turn, but then you can't safely, really. Uh, I'm not too worried about shift tree as long as I have reflect up. I mean I guess they could be faster and crit a leaf blade. But if I'm terra flying, that won't be a problem. So I kinda like where I'm at. They're thinking long and hard. Yeah, Torque will swap and they saw the encore coming. I guess I should have doubled the uh, Salamence. Maybe the Salamence. Salamence doesn't have Protect. They have Terra Ghost. It's not really going to help them against the Terra Blast. The Hariyama Knockoff Detect Brick Break Facade. I mean, with Guts, Terra Normal Facade, it can do a ton of damage to Gyarados. Not going to lie. And crit takes out Salamence. I don't know if that was necessary, but I'll take it. And Encore fails, but I didn't have much better to do. Because I could have Thunderbolted the Hariyama. Because I could have nuzzled it. I, I wasn't going to read Torkoal Swap there when it could do so much damage to my Gyarados. Since I dropped my Water type. Alright, 
Alright, there's Torkoal. Um, I think I Terra Blast Hariyama. And Thunderbolt Torkoal just split my damage a bit. One of these has to go through well. Uh, the Terra must be on Hariyama, and I was considering doubling the Hariyama. I was like, you don't want to detect in front of a Raichu with Encore, but... I don't know. I don't think I have enough juice to KO either thing here, unless I doubled in. And I didn't double in, so I could lose Gyarados, honestly. That would be bad. Oh, huge damage to Hariyama, though. Big damage to Torkoal? Pretty good. Alright, there's the normal facade. Gyarados barely eats this, I'm guessing. Yeah, 5 HP. And Earth Power! Oh, I'm still alive! Nobody went down there. Sun is gone. No priority. Raichu can Thunderbolt to finish off your Hariyama. And I can... I think I'm going to Terra Blast the Torkoal rather than Waterfall it. Because I want to catch the swap into Shiftry. Ah, oh, there's the swap into Shiftry. No! <laughs> Alright. Got me there. Oh, I guess it could have been... Nuzzle into Hariyama. Try to finish it off with that. No, it's a minus one nuzzle. I don't know if that would have been enough. Maybe I'll get the para with Thunderbolt anyway. And you don't have speed, you just have Sucker Punch. That was a crit Thunderbolt. Oh, and a para! There it is! <laughs> wow. Alright, the problem with attacking Hariyama... No, Hariyama can't protect. Because it's going down to burn very soon. In fact, I could just protect Gyarados to guarantee it goes down. In fact, I could bring in Latios. Hariyama goes down. Maybe I lose Latios. Yeah, no, that works. Because then if I lose Latios, I get another fake out turn. If I don't lose Latios, I can double in to Shiftry. With things I can actually KO it. Detect from Hariyama? Oh, do you know you can live the burn? Sucker Punch fails. No, I'm fine with this turn then. Is that gone? It is gone. Okay, cool. And I guess I have to rely on Draco here, but that's not the worst. Sucker Punch into Latios, that's fine. It only does half, good to know. Terrible Blast cleans up. Alright, good game one. Whew. Kerado is hanging on by a thread here. That tells me those screens are really important. Alright. I will try to sweep you again with Gyarados in game two, probably. Alright, here we go again. Um, I do think Shiftry might come on lead. But with Torkoal, it would be faster than my Raichu anyway. So I think Sableye Gyarados is fine. I like Raichu... I still like Latios. It resists fire. If sun is up, it can throw big, powerful weather balls into uh, Shiftry or Metagross. They bring that this time. And Draco is great into, like, like, five of those Pokemon just drop to Draco. If I had to guess. Eh, Gyarados probably doesn't, but the rest. Unless they Terra. And the, uh... Salamence's Ghost Terror. Yeah, that might be able to take it. Depends on investment. It's Life Orb, so I doubt it's very bulky.
Um, because of the Gyarados, I think they might bring... I mean, their own Gyarados doesn't really hit my Gyarados, but it can Thunder Wave it. Which would be annoying. Uh, there's Salamence setting up in the face of my Gyarados. Setting up faster could be a threat. But if it sets up, Foul Play can punish. Though with how much damage Torkoal just deals immediately, I don't know. At least they got a cool fire Pokemon as their card. Torkoal Shiftry again. Alright, we're running it back. Same leads. Alright, and in that case... Let's light screen, go straight for Dragon Dance, not waste any time. Because they're going to read the Fake Out, they're going to read the Protect on the Fake Out. They're going to Terastalize. Shiftry into Poison. I don't hate that. A little worried about a Terra Blast turn one, I guess. Yeah, and they did not Fake Out. As I thought. Just doubling into Sableye, trying to get rid of that. Okay. That means I don't get my Reflect. That's annoying. <clears throat> but setting up with Gyarados turn one, pretty strong. <clears throat> Sucker Punch did about half to Latios. Shouldn't KO, but like I don't need to risk it right now. I'm gonna Raichu, I'm going to fake out Shiftry. I'll just Waterfall Torkoal. I, I do need to get rid of Torkoal. Facts are facts. Yeah, there goes Shiftry, fine. Oh, and there's Gyarados. And you already burned Terra. Oh no. And that's half the Torkoal. That's all I need. Thunderbolt their Gyarados, and Waterfall is 80, 120, doubled in Sun, ha doubled in Super Effective Half from Sun, 120. Terra Blast would be stronger. Yeah, okay. Terra Blast is 80, and then with same type Terrastalization, it's doubled. And if they're going to swap out, Waterfall's not going to do anything to a Metagross? Ooh. Nothing's going to do much to a Metagross. But at least I get the Thunderbolt. Hmm. Metagross is going to be a problem. Leftovers too, so it's gonna. Oh, it's okay. I don't have Reflect up. It has Meteor Mash and Bullet Punch and Iron Defense. I mean, not too scary. If my Gyarados hadn't terastalized, I would be very unscared. Um, I could also Para Flinch. Um, here's Shiftry. Which can get a fake out on either target here. How's this weather looking? Two turns of sun. I'm gonna nuzzle Metagross. Terra Blast Shiftry. 
Sucker Punch finishes Raichu, yikes. Hopefully I can pick up Shiftry. I mean, it's not that bulky, right? If I can pick up Shiftry, Latios is safe. Yes! Excellent. Uh, the sun's about to end, which is bad. Uh, how much can you do to my Gyarados here? Probably a lot. 6 HP and an attack boost. Okay, we got this. We totally got this. Because Torkoal has Heat Wave, Eruption, Earth Power. None of that's doing much to Latios. I can Weather Ball, but only this turn. They can both protect. No, Metagross cannot protect. Yo. Metagross is entirely unable to protect. I can Weather Ball the Metagross and just protect Gyarados. Perfect. Because Bullet Punch should be incoming. Torkoal protects. Don't care about that. Let's go. Thank you for giving me sun. Get out of here, Metagross. No bullet punch. Okay, so they called the Gyarados Protect. That's good, at least. Good call. Oh, yeah. And the sun is gone. I now have Luster Purge and a full-powered waterfall. Let's go, Gyarados. Let's go. Woo! G to the G's. Cool team, good games. Alright, that's a choice ban Slay King over there, and it's Terra Fairy, so I can't just nuke it with Draco. Uh, we can get a fake out turn pretty freely. Um. I don't want to do Raichu Sableye. That might be too passive, but like a fake out turn plus a foul play, maybe? Um, who can best take advantage of a fake out turn? Because they've got Will O Wisp for my Metagross on their Weezing. Gyarados isn't going to be able to get an Intimidate down. Ghost Guard of War is interesting. But then they could just hit the thing next to it. I mean, I don't hate Latios Raichu. Sableye in the back for either Foul Playing or Sunny Day. I'm sure they bring weather. And then finally, is it Gyarados? Metagross? Metagross kinda walls. Yeah, Metagross is good if I can get rid of Weezing. And even if I don't, I mean, if they're not invested to be faster, I can hit it hard. And especially if I put up Sun. But if I put up Sun, Pelipper could have a Fire-type Weather Ball, so I gotta be careful about that. I can wall Kingdra in the Sun. I can wall Latios either way. Their Metagross has Knock Off. Pelipper Kingdra. All right. Uh, they do both have Protect. But if they Protect their Pelipper, they could be in trouble. water on Pelipper as well, so I can Thunderbolt it for mostly free. I'm gonna double into Pelipper. Yeah, my worst fear is Kingdra going for Protect and they get Tailwind up. They just Protect both, fine.
I can now encore their Pelipper. If I wanted to. I could also protect Latios and nuzzle their Kingdra. I like that. Man, this is a this is gonna be a tough game. Okay, here's the Terra. It must be the King Drain to steal, right? Yeah. That means Pelipper isn't going anywhere. Could've encored. Alright. Uh, and it's just Muddy Water. Okay, is it Muddy Water plus Hurricane? Muddy Water plus Tailwind? Are you doubling Raichu? I like the Para, but if you Tailwind, you're faster than my Latios again anyway. Uh, you didn't Tailwind. Okay, Weather Ball. Nice. Now I can bring in Sableye. Now my sunny day might be obvious. But so what? I'm doing it. Sunny day, Weather Ball, Kingdra. Ooh, and they let me get away with it. Nice. Kingdra is gone. Thank you. All right. Uh, we got rid of their Terra and their main sweeper. Uh, they might get Tailwind up here, though. Nope, just a Weather Ball into Sableye, which will do some good damage. No joke, that did a lot of damage. Now, they could have Weezing. Slay King in the back. That's what I expect, actually. But a Metagross or a Latios? I mean, those are threatening, too. Maybe they didn't think Weezing Slay King was the play this game. We'll see. Oh, they do. Okay. They're Slay King. They already burned Terra, so they can't get around Draco. might be enough to take them. And then... High Horsepower, Rock Slide, Drain Punch, Body Slam. I think I want to set Light Screen if I can survive. Okay, gotcha. You're just leaving both in to attack. Okay. Draco Meteor. Misses the Slay King. Okay, that's probably game. GG. That's com that's completely over on that miss. I mean, you are locked into Body Slam. I can take advantage of that at least. You got Fire Weather Ball into my Metagross. Terra Ground, Psychic Fangs, the Pelipper. Try to put up Reflect while I can? If I can? I don't know. Ah, this is so difficult. Slay King Swap. I thought it might. 
I was considering going for Psychic Fangs there. I don't know if it even takes Weezing, though. Yeah, Slay King doesn't want to be locked into Body Slam. Which means my Terra doesn't hurt me. Uh, I mean, if they just take out... If they can take out Sableye here, they're in a good position. I think they do. Yep. Will-O-Wisp, Sludge Bomb, Protect, Taunt from Weezing. Two turns of Sun, six turns of Light Screen. I'm better off taking out the Weezing if I can. Weather Ball, Weather Ball hurt, but I mean they could go out and get the Rain back. That's not gonna do much actually. Will O Wisp connects, basically sealing my fate. They are also faster than my Metagross, that's good to know. And that would not have KO'd anyway. Using a Citrus Berry. Uh, maybe I crit it here for the KO. I'm gonna keep throwing moves. I'm not just gonna forfeit here. I wanna see what else I can learn, if anything. Oh, yep, yeah. get rid of the wheezing, get the rain back, makes sense. Now for a powerful weather ball. Never had a chance. Alright. GG. <laughs> that doesn't take me out, that's funny. Alright. And that was a crit. Great. Alright, now I'll run with this Metagross, having learned something. And that something is Metagross is really good. But I have to not get burned. Okay. Let's run round two. Alright, let's see if I can not miss a Draco Meteor this time. Wouldn't that be swell? Uh, I think Metagross is pretty good. So if I set up Sun, it's annoying because they get the Weather Ball. Um... Gyarados, not the worst. Gardevoir, also not the worst, but also not the best. Latios was great. Latios should have been great. I think I'll save Latios for the back. I think I'll do Metagross, Raichu, Latios. Do I even bring Sableye? I could also go Sableye, Metagross with Latios in the back, and Raichu. I think Raichu can be pretty strong in the late game, getting a para on Slaking if they go for the same route, which they probably do. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see what I can do. Alright. Is it the same thing? No, it's Metagross Latios. Okay, I don't mind this at all. You got knockoff from my Metagross, but not a whole lot else. You have Terra Steel Latios. You have Assault Vest Metagross. I could pretty easily set Reflect or Light Screen. Heavy Slam Latios set light screen for now. No. Heavy Slam Latios. Foul play Metagross. And just dr throw a Draco right from the get go. Goodbye, Sableye. <laughs> Should have put up light screen. Okay. Huge damage to Latios, love to see that. And they do knock off my Metagross for over half. Horrendous. Yeah, I 
think I go Raichu here. Metagross has no way around Fake Out. Latios could protect on this Bullet Punch. Bullet Punch might be too obvious. So maybe I go for Heavy Slam. And just nuzzle the Metagross. I don't I don't love it. I have to I have to be making reads. And I haven't been doing great with my reads. Oh, they just go for an icy wind to break my Raichu sash. Fine. Well, it's not fine because Can you knock out my Raichu with Metagross? Maybe. But at least I parried you. Oh, there's a crit. Thanks. Love that. The Psychic Fang does pick up Raichu, come on! Oh, this is going horrendous. This could not be worse. Oh, wow. Um... If I'd gone for the bullet punch, I would still have Raichu. Oh, here's Weezing. Hi. Hi, Weezing. Nice to see you. Uh, do they just go for Protect on Weezing? Do they go for Will-O-Wisp onto my Metagross? They're wheezing? Probably. I don't know if this is the right play, but I'm gonna go Terra Ground Earthquake Protect. Looks like Weezing isn't going for a Terra because they are faster than me, so I think I got it right. I think they're going to protect Weezing and try to attack Latios with their Metagross. Oh, it's a Terra from their Weezing. I'm... I thought they were invested to be faster. I guess not. Okay, well that's terrible. <laughs> I would have assumed they were fat and tried to invest to be faster than Metagross. Alright. Well, I should get okay damage here. Maybe you can make up for the Draco miss from game one by giving me a Willow dodge. Big damage on the Metagross. Love to see that. No chance of a dodge. Metagross is faster than both of them, though. But Earthquake will hit my Latios, which is annoying. They do in fact go for a knockoff there. That's cool. Um, I think I have to Earthquake my own Latios. With the burn, it shouldn't be too bad. Luster Purge the Weezing. Which just protects. With Draco Bullet Punch, I'm pretty sure I can secure Slaking. It must be Slaking last, and they have to lock in. I mean, they can do just lock in Body Slam. That should KO either one of my Pokemon. Sludge Bomb. Yeah, I think that'll do it. Bullet Punch. Plus Draco Meteor. Probably takes Slaking. Like, nine times out of ten. This, it, I, I'm very confident this should do it. If you invest your Slaking for this, it would be a Soul Dew uh, Draco Meteor, not a Life Orb Draco Meteor after Bullet Punch. 
Oh my goodness, they live anyway. Goodbye, Latios. Oh, and they did attack Latios. Yeah, there's no way I win this now. Great. Ah. Oh. GG's. Hmm. Getting 2 0'd by Slay King. Rough. Alright, here we got a rain team. The Pelipper and the Ludicolo both have Weather Ball. So I'm a little scared to just put up Sun. Uh, there's also Scarf, Terra Fairy, Gardevoir. Uh, Dragon Dance, Ments, but it's just Dragon Claw, Rock Slide. Fake Out, Sucker Punch. Poison, Terra Blast, Leaf Blade, Shiftry with AV. Wind Rider. Uh, the Pelipper is the Tailwind. Metagross has Iron Head, Lumberry. Oh, and Terra Fairy. Interesting. I want to go Sableye, Latios. That's what I think I want to do here, because if it's Metagross, I can Weather Ball it in the sun. If it's the Rain Squad, I can set up screens or set up sun. I think that's mostly okay. Um, Shiftry being vulnerable to Intimidate, I kind of like. Clear Amulet's on their Salamence. So maybe I could bring Gyarados. Maybe. My own Gardevoir. I like my Metagross, even if I am putting up the sun for their Weather Balls. I like Metagross. Uh, and then finally, is it Raichu? Is it Gyarados? Is it Gardevoir? Gyarados... Uh, does, their Gar does their Metagross have Psychic Fangs? It does. I'm gonna go Raichu. I want more support here. I want Fake Out. Uh, they have a few... Choice. They have Choice uh, Gardevoir, they have AV Shiftry. Um, they have Cloak on Ludicolo, actually, even though it only has attacks. And Metagross doesn't have any um, Protect either, so they've, they've got a lot of things I can fake out for free at some point. And they've got Burrit in their picture. Alright, Shiftry Gardevoir. Scarf Gardevoir with, uh, I guess it's gonna copy Prankster. Gleam, Moonblast, Psychic, T-Bolt. Shiftry is Fake Out, Leaf Blade, Sucker Punch, Terra Blast. Well, they're gonna throw a Fairy move. That's for sure. Maybe I just Sunny Day and send it. They could fake out Latios, in which case I should just light screen, protect. But if they read that... If they read this and double into Sableye is where I could get in trouble. Or if Terra Fairy Moonblast can Oko Sableye through light screen. This might be too easy to read. I may I may have thrown. If they fake out here, I did right. Sucker punch. Okay, that's fine. I'm fine with that. Now Sableye, I need you to eat a dazzling gleam. Oh, that's fine. I can eat that. That should be doable. Woo! Not much health left. All right, let's Sunny Day, Terra Weather Ball. I kind of don't want to be Terra Fire, but I also kind of need to be Terra Fire. Here we go. All right, no swaps. That's good. Sucker Punch will still do something to be honest. 
It's not gonna bounce off harmlessly. The Dazzling Gleam basically would. Yeah, that's good damage. Yikes. Glad I'm getting rid of that. Yeah. The Gleam should take Sableye. How much does it do to Latio? You go from 87 to 64. 23 damage. Um, they also have the Polo, which in the rain could be faster. Yeah, Polo Punch Metagross, but that's not going to do much of anything. Uh, I expect Ludicolo or Pelipper to come in. I mean, Metagross is pretty free. The Gardevoir has to basically leave. And it is Pelipper. So I guess the question is, is Pelipper going to protect here? Because I could Bullet Punch... Luster Purge probably takes it. Their switch in would be Ludicolo. They could protect swap in Ludicolo for a fake out turn. I don't know. I think this is fine. Ludicolo, right? It's Metagross. Oh. Alright, let's hit that Pelipper. It did not protect, which is great for me. And it's gone. Fantastic. And now their Gardevoir. It's gonna have Levitate, which is a little annoying. Uh, I could protect Bullet Punch, Bullet Punch. They've got, what, Stomping Tantrum. Iron Head, Bullet Punch, Psychic Fangs. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that. Oh, they trace Clear Body? I thought it went straight across. Huh. Interesting. Um, would they lock Thunderbolt? No, not with Raichu in the back. I guess I should go for Bullet Punch into Bullet Punch. No, I should go for Heavy Slam. Get rid of it here. I guess fast Metagross stomping plus Thunderbolt into Metagross? I don't think that takes me. I still have Light Screen up, after all. Yeah, it's just Psychic into Latios. That makes sense. And you're gone. And I'm faster, which is great. And then it must be a stomping, right? Into my Metagross. Yeah, there it is. Which does under half. Fantastic. Earthquake. Rain Weather Ball. You're not a salt vest like me, so this should hurt a lot. Ooh, yeah, good damage. And I am faster with Metagross. Yeah. So it's not like a speed tire. I'm, I've only put 12 EVs in speed into my Metagross. I just figure some people might only put 4. So it's like a very slight speed creep, but anyone who actually wants a fast Metagross is going to be faster. Alright, that's game 1. GG. Alright, do I think I can get away with the same stuff? I don't know. Uh, having Metagross just for their Gardevoir is amazing. So I don't want to lead it and lose it. Um... Sableye Latios worked, but only just barely. Can't rely on them leading Gardevoir again anyway. Uh, Gyarados seems pretty good. You do have to worry about like Psychic Fangs from Metagross. And not being able to do too much with Waterfall. Um, Sableye Raichu, while passive, doesn't seem too bad. But maybe I should do Sableye Latios again with Metagross. And instead of Raichu, maybe I just have Gyarados in the back. Yeah, Gyarados can 
do some good damage in the rain, which they're going to set up for me. It can take some hits from their water types. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to save Terra for it. Ludicolo Pelipper League, cool. Should be able to put up Sun pretty freely. Maybe I go for Light Screen instead, though. Uh, they've got Weather Ball on both. They double into Sableye with Weather Ball, Weather Ball. Might be fine behind light screen. I'll throw a luster purge at their Pelipper slot. Okay. They're not leaving. They're not faking out either. It is a Weather Ball into Sableye. Big damage. Luster Purge into their Pelipper. Leaving it at Sash. About what I expected there. And a special defense drop that doesn't matter. Uh, what do you go for? Tailwind? Weatherball? Hurricane? Hurricane into Sableye. Which is enough. Okay. We're playing in the rain. Which Gyarados actually kind of loves. I may need more than one Dragon Dance, though. Uh, I'm gonna Dragon Dance with Gyarados. Don't want to bring in Metagross yet. Do I fear the Ice Beam from Ludicolo? Do I want to just protect? Do I fear them? Getting a switch more than I fear. I'm gonna weather ball their caliber. Okay, Terra Steel from Ludicolo looks like. Yeah, that's cool. That means Gyarados can actually hit you, uh, but it also means your Guard of War with Thunderbolt is there. Hmm, maybe I should have brought Raichu. Yeah, just Ice Beam into Latios, he can eat that. Oh, that didn't do much at all with light screen. Happy to take your Pelipper. And yeah, with light screen up and Terra flying on Gyarados, we should be able to handle a Gardevoir. The problem is the double up from Gardevoir and Ludicolo. We're looking pretty good. Gardevoir with Thunderbolt coming out. Shift Tree with Fake Out. Fake Out, Sucker Punch. Uh, I could pretty easily just protect, bring in Metagross here. I think that's what I want to do. Metagross can threaten some big damage and so can Gyarados. Do I wish I had Raichu? Maybe. What, over Metagross? No. Who would I drop? Sableye? The screen is what's keeping me alive. Yeah, Sucker Punch fails, but we don't know who it was targeting. Probably Latios. And then Weather Ball into Gyarados. Fine. Uh, Weather Ball was going into Gyarados. I think maybe what I want to do is not Terra. Waterfall Ludicolo probably is enough. Heavy Slam Shifty might be enough. Yeah, Sucker Punch into Metagross. Could be a double into Metagross, honestly. No, it's an Ice Beam into Gyarados. That bounces off. 
But it freezes! Oh no! Oh no, don't do this to me! Don't do this! No! Ship tree hangs on too. No, don't do this to me. Who do I think is in the back? Metagross? Or Gardevoir? Come on. Waterfall, Shift Tree. I have to thaw. Come on, Gyarados. I can't win this if you don't thaw. Because they can double the Metagross slot here so free with Sucker Punch and Weather Ball. Yeah, there's Sucker Punch. Okay. Please thaw. Claudio eats that at least. Come on, Gyarados. You have to thaw. You have to. You have to. Yeah, I'm gonna waterfall protect, because what else can I do? Sucker punch into Latios fails, at least. Uh, Gyarados is still frozen. Come on, Gyarados. You have to thaw. You just have to. You gotta. Waterfall shift tree. Bring in Metagross, I guess. Oh. Oh no. Okay, Sucker Punch fails again. Maybe they'll stop doing that eventually. Gyarados is still frozen. <laughs> no! They are hitting it eventually. Ugh. Waterfall shift tree. Do they Giga Drain my Metagross to cover for Terra Ground EQ? I don't think they do. I think I can go for it. I, I have to do something. Gyarados is never gonna thaw for some reason. But if Gyarados does thaw, I mean, we can win that way. Oh, boy. Gyarados frozen solid. Ice Beam into Metagross. Covering the swap. We played into Gyarados, finally pinning it out of its misery. But that means we get the Earthquake. Which is absolutely enormous. It does it to Ludicolo. Yes. That may not be enough, though. Light screen is gone. Who do they have left? Is it Gardevoir? It's Metagross. We know we're faster than their Metagross. We can get the Stab Earthquake. I mean, they can go for Bullet Punch if they want. Draco, don't fail me now. Come on. Oh, the freeze. Draco! Draco! What are you doing? What are you actually doing? That's Draco Range! Ladios! Ladios! No, this can't be happening right now. This game is not happening. Alright, Ladios, you have to live a bullet punch with 33 HP. There are no field conditions to protect about. You, sh you were just supposed to hit that Draco. Oh, no. Oh, come on! Come on! Uh. Oh. Man. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man. Uh. 
Sableye, Latios, Gyarados, Metagross. It's probably right. It's gotta be the right four. Maybe I should try to get Reflect up this time. That last game was so brutal. I, I, I've never had a more brutal match than that. The problem is now they're going to be ready for Gyarados. So I can't just do whatever I want. Um, putting up Sun prevents Freeze. So maybe I should have put up Sun. I don't know. Are we having a connection issue? Is it, is it gonna play? Is it gonna let us play the game? Hello? Are you there? Game? What's happening right now? There we are. Okay. Looks like it's gonna let us play. Oh boy. What do you got? Pelipper Shift Tree this time. Okay, I like bringing in Gyarados. Because I can intimidate Shift Tree. And Pelipper doesn't threaten Gyarados. Shiftry is gonna fake out that slot anyway. Leaf Blade, Sucker Punch, Terra Blast. They might not. They might just double Sableye. So I like putting up Light Screen. No, I prefer putting up Reflect. If I can only get one, it probably should be Reflect. And bring in Gyarados. And if they double into Sableye with like Leaf Blade, Weather Ball, I think with Intimidate and Reflect. Uh, I think Intimidate plus Light Screen, I might have had a better chance of living. Especially because Leaf Blade might just crit, and the way these games have been going, that's basically what I anticipate happening. Hurricane into Sableye. Does a lot of damage. Leaf Blade into Sableye doesn't do it. Good. That's awesome. Alright, I can get Light Screen. And Dragon Dance is mostly free. We're gonna do what? Tailwind? Hurricane. Going for a confusion. You can hax me once, you can hax me twice! Okay, I got the Dragon Dance. Um. <laughs> yeah. They don't take out Sableye. At least not successfully. Let's foul play just to try to knock Pelipper's Sash. And Terra Blast the Shift Tree. Get it out of here. Shift Tree is a threat to what I have in the back. I get rid of their Sucker Puncher, I'm feeling better. Maybe I could have set Sun here, but Metagross wouldn't appreciate them having Fire Weather Ball. And I mean, I have to get through these confusions. Thank you. Thank you, Gyarados. I appreciate you so much. Oh boy. into Gyarados again. Let's me break your Sash, which is good. And into their Metagross. Pretty good, since I can Waterfall that. Um... 
could get Sableye out. I mean, you have to attack Sableye with something. Waterfall and Metagross is also really good. I think I want to bring in my Metagross. And I want to go for Waterfall on there, Metagross. Yeah, I think that's what I want to do. Because I need to hit Metagross with something that can hit Metagross. Yeah, Bullet Punch bounces right off my Metagross. That's great. Gyarados snaps out of Confusion. Throws a huge Waterfall. Big damage. And then Weather Ball probably finishes off our Gyarados. No, it doesn't! A uh, bullet punch can, but I can earthquake protect because you don't have wide guard. You do have tailwind. I guess you could tailwind here. Yeah, I'm just gonna protect, and I'm gonna try to take out your metagross. You can tailwind if you want. Probably the right play, honestly. No, just a Weather Ball and a Metagross. That shouldn't do too much. Yeah, AV and Light Screen coming in clutch. And Metagross down. Metagross is down. Let's go. No Tailwind up either. And Rain is gone. Yes. Uh, Ludicolo does have a fake out, potentially. Yeah. Y'all are pretty much useless without weather, though. I think I'm gonna go Psychic Fangs into Ludicolo. And a double protect on, Metagro uh, on Gyarados. If I don't get it, I don't get it. But if I swap Gyarados out, I'm gonna be slower than them anyway. And can get easily taken out. Basically all up to Metagross and Latios, and they can do it. They can do it. Pelipper should be in Luster Purge range. Um, they could Tailwind here, but they still can't do much damage. Is this the uh, Ludicolo? Fine. That is fine. I wasn't gonna Oko anyway. I can follow up with an Earthquake. Uh, I don't get the Protect, so I'm going to go down to Fake Out. They didn't go for Fake Out. We dodged the Hurricane. Wow. I should have attacked. Okay. Good play. Really good play. Now basically what I need to do... Oh, big damage. Wow. I just need to Luster Purge the Pelipper and Earthquake, and that should be sealing it. Earthquake, take out Ludicolo. Luster Purge, take out Pelipper. They can hacks with Ice Beam, I guess. But even then, it would be hard to break through all this. So you would have to freeze Metagross here with Ice Beam. And then I could maybe get Sunny Day up and Weather Ball you. Oh no, you're just going after Latios anyway. Yep, Earthquake should seal the deal. Let's go! Oh man! After that game too, it feels nice to win this one. Okay, Nerd Slayer. That is a problem because Raichu's fake out would be slower than Ludicolo's fake out. Uh, it's a Cloak Pelipper, even. Interesting, with Tailwind. Uh, Spex Kingdra. Scarf Latios. Sash Metacham. 
AV, Metagross, nothing crazy there. Okay, uh, I really like my Metagross. Problem is, Kingdra in the rain can blow it up, and Pelipper in the sun can blow it up. So maybe Metagross endgame. But first, Sableye. I need to reduce the damage they can do. That's for sure. And then maybe Gyarados would be fine? I think so. Try to start a sweep with Gyarados. Have Metagross in the back. And finally, it could be Gardevoir or Latios. I kind of like Gardevoir as an answer to their rain squad. Like, Metagross is the only thing that can really do much. Especially if I, like, put up Sun. Uh, so I think I'll go Gardevoir this time. Not having Latios is weird. But we'll see what happens. Um, Gardevoir... Uh, could Gardevoir have been the lead? I don't know. Alright, Pelipper Ludicolo. Alright, they got the Fake Out, Swift Swim, Tailwind, Shenanigans. Okay. Fake Out, Encore, Hydro Pump, Energy Ball. They could Encore my Sableye. And I could Sunny Day. <laughs> Terra Fairy Ludicolo, Terra Grass Pelipper. I think Light Screen is probably fine. No, I'm gonna Sunny Day first. No. I'm gonna Light Screen. And I'm gonna Waterfall Pelipper. Okay, they just fake out. I don't want to protect in front of it because it has Encore. That's the, that's the one problem I had there. Gyarados flinches, we're faster than Pelipper. We were faster than Pelipper. Gotcha. I can now Sunny Day and Terra Blast the Ludicolo. I don't hate that play. I think I'll do it. There goes Pelipper. Alright, cool. I didn't want Sun up permanently anyway. Here comes Kingdra. Ooh, Kingdra coming in on a sunny day. You don't like that. And I'm terrestrializing first, meaning they are not. Which is great. Which is so great. Uh, they might still be faster, even in the sun, because I mean, they're 80 base speed, I'm 81, I'm not max. So this Terra Blast could probably go second, honestly. Yeah, Encore me into Sunny Day. Fine. Sun's already up. And I got Light Stream. I could Sunny Day again if you bring in Pelipper, but don't do that. Oh, I was thinking that the Speed Tears. No, they have Tailwind up anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, if you bring in Pelipper hard here, I can just Sunny Day again. So you don't. You bring in Latios. You could double my Gyarados, but I could protect. I could Sunny Day again. I could see them locking a Dragon move, so I don't hate. They could also flip turn with Latios. Oh, that's the play. I'm gonna stay in Quick Sunny Day again and protect. This may seem like a weird play, but I kinda want Sableye on the field. Unless they're trying to delete it specifically. And they lock Ice Beam. Okay. And they just throw a Draco. Sableye eats that. I could 
bring in Metagross and Gardevoir here. No need for Reflect. Still Encore. I do want to get Sableye out. Into Gardevoir. Terror Blast the Kingdra Slot. Uh, I guess they could try to double Gyarados and remove it, but with Light Screen up, it's gonna be hard. There's Ice Beam, which can't freeze in the sun. Oh, it didn't do much at all. And half a Draco, yeah, they did double the Gyarados, that makes sense. When I've shown that I'm willing to click Sunny Day in the sun. Alright, now don't KO. Thank you. Let's see, they could swap in Pelipper here. They could terastalize anything. Latios is Steel Terra. Probably just try to finish off Gyarados with Ice Beam. I think I want to Moonblast the Latios. And bring in Metagross. Yeah, there goes Kingdra. Okay. Into Pelipper. That's fine. I wasn't going to be able to Oko Pelipper. I can taunt it to prevent another Tailwind if I want, but I don't think that's necessary. And then your Ice Beam isn't going to do much. Uh, but we do get a Steel Terra. Fine. I get it. Gonna keep spamming Ice Beam though, you're not really gonna do much. Oh, you're gonna freeze me. Where have I seen this before? <sighs> Alright. Let's get to work on that Pelipper. Moonblast. Psychic things. Yeah, does Ice Beam my, my Gardevoir? Whatever. Moonblast for Pelipper. Doesn't do half. Metagross is frozen, but faster than their Pelipper. Interesting. And Weather Ball. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt a lot. <sighs> Basically, I'm stalling turns until Metagross can thaw. I think I can sack Gyarados. I can also Life Dew. No, I'll sack Gyarados. Psychic Fangs Pelipper. Yeah, Latios swaps into Kingdra. Fine. I can pull out the sunny day if you take, take the Gyarados here. And every turn you waste is a turn that I could thaw. Oh lord. Freezes, man. Freezes. Thawed! Yes! Get out of here, Pelipper. Yeah. Okay, that's big. That is so big like that a lot. Alright, now they gotta pick a move on Latios. Luster Purge, Ice Beam, Draco, Flip Turn. None of those are good choices. Kingdra needs to rip my Metagross in half. Metagross has to win the day. Yeah, I will go for a Terra Blast into Kingdra. And sacrifice Gardevoir to a Hydro Pump. That's gotta be what's coming. And then I just put up Sun and Hydro Pump stops doing damage. 
Yep. Gardevoir, you could have tried dodging. Like, come on. <laughs> Metagross in the sun versus Latios spamming Luster Purge. That won't do anything. Oh, that's beautiful. That'll do actually nothing to my Sableye. Oh, light screen's gone, though. That's probably fine. Heavy Slam's probably, what, a three shot on Latios? Maybe four? Cluster Purge is never going to take Metagross, though. Last turn of rain anyway. I'm going to Psychic Fangs the Kingdra and set Sunny Day, right? Yeah, that's what I gotta do. <coughs> now the Hydro Pump should be at Sableye. It'll come after this Luster Purge, which does negative damage. Beautiful. Oh no, you Hydro Pump the Metagross. Interesting. Because now you can't beat Sableye. You had to KO Sableye there. I can win with Foul Play alone now. Good game. Show me how much Heavy Slam does to your Latios, please. Battle's cancelled. Okay. Good round one. GG's. Okay. How do I win this game? I think what I had was good. Maybe not great, but good. With Sableye Gyarados. Sableye's big. They're gonna wanna get rid of Sableye. Uh, Gardevoir Metagross seems okay. Should Latios be over Gardevoir? I don't think so. I think Gardevoir was good. I did end up having to sack it to a Hydro Pump, but that's just because I, I found a winning position. It also forced the Terra out on Latios, which is good. Yeah, I think those four. Um... What could be going wrong? I mean, Weather Ball into my Metagross is always a problem from their Pelipper. Thankfully, Ludicolo has Hydro Pump instead. And Kingdra. Kingdra can also learn Weather Ball. Um, there's nothing on the Latios to hit a Metagross. Maybe Metacham comes this time? Metagross, Latios. Interesting. AV with Heavy Slam, Psychic Fangs, Knock Off, Bullet Punch. I could steal Terra, my Sableye, in this match. Go for a foul play in the Metagross. Because they're trying to take it. They're going to try to take it out. Or disable my screens with Psychic Fangs. Yeah, if they... Yeah, protect Eridos. Yeah. Yeah, protect Eridos. This could be a game-winning play. Nope, they do Terra. It must be the Metagross into Fairy, right? Yeah. Okay. I get to at least see what you're up to. <laughs> see what sorts of shenanigans you lock into with the Latios. And if it's Draco, even better, because then, I mean, I can't really Psychic Fang. The psychic Fangs will get rid of my screen if I go that route. Oh, if you try to bring in Pelipper, then I can get a powerful Waterfall off. Luster Purge into Gyarados, okay. Heavy Slam into Sand. We eat that very nicely. Cool. I really want to get rid of Metagross. <laughs> Maybe I light screen so Gyarados can take a hit. Maybe I bring in my own Metagross. They have knockoff though. I 
knock off my Sableye here. Uh, I think I'll put up light screen. I'll want that for later anyway. And I will waterfall their Metagross. Make sure they could Psychic Fangs. They could. They probably do double into Gyarados here with Psychic Fangs Luster Purge, right? Maybe this was a bad play. I don't know if Psychic Fangs can pick up from there, but good damage on the Metagross. Uh, no, just knock off into Sableye. Cool. Don't mind that. I might as well put up my Reflect, and... Now they would want a Psychic Fang, right? Would they double Gyarados? If so, I can trade. Yeah. Uh, Metagross swapping. Into Ludicolo. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Neither Foul Play nor Waterfall will do very much to that. But damage is damage, you know? Oh, actually, Foul Play did a lot. Um, I could put up Reflect. Uh, I'm vulnerable to Encore from Ludicolo. I think I do want Reflect for later. So I can throw that up now, unless they fake me out. And I could bring in Metagross here, safely-ish. Like, the only fear there would be, but Latios isn't swapping. Like, a swap to Pelipper and a Hydro Pump right into that slot would be, like, terrifying. But it's not what's happening. Okay, they let me get Reflect up. Cool. You'll have to Psychic Fangs that later. And Luster Purge just bounces right off. Are you gonna take Sableye now so I can't ever put Sun? Yes. Gotcha. That makes sense. That makes perfect sense. I'm gonna bring in Gardevoir now. While Metagross is not on the field. And I'm threatening huge damage here. Uh, they can swap in their Metagross, which is pretty low health. They could swap in Pelipper. And try to KO something with Ludicolo, but through screen, that's not going to do anything. You are... You are Mystic Water, so it'll do something, actually. But yeah, Moonblast here. Psychic Fangs over here. Should be enough. Well, not enough. Like, Latios isn't going to go down to one Moonblast, but it's not staying in, I would guess. Pelipper probably takes under half. Metagross probably doesn't go down from where it's at if it swaps in. But I don't hate my positioning right now. Luster Purge into Metagross. Is that just a stack of Latios, or I'm not willing to swap right now? I'm glad I don't take it out, actually. And a special attack drop. Nice. And just a Hydro Pump in there. Okay. Psychic Fangs takes Ludicolo. Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. A minus one Latios is basically ignorable. What do you do? Do you go into Metagross? Are you in bullet punch range? You might be. Maybe not. It'd, it'd be close. I know I can take a bullet punch with my Gardevoir though. So you're not gonna take it out. And you gotta have Pelipper, right? Oh, Medichem? Medichem? So you got a fake out turn. Or close combat into Metagross. I think what I have is a Moonblast into Metacham. And a swap to Gyarados. Get an Intimidate down. Maybe lose Gyarados, whatever. 
Gyarados isn't particularly useful to the end game here. Okay, just a protect from Metacham. Okay. Is that a free KO on Gyarados for you? Did you call that? Yes, you did. Nice. Oh, does that KO? Minus one? No. <laughs> Oh boy. That means I get to hit Metachain. With Moonblast. To the face. And if you want to swap Latios, you might have to take another hit. A uh, Metachain swaps. That's cool. I'm cool with that. Into Metagross. Just to get that Intimidate off it. Because it's your only way of breaking through my Metagross. But what I really like is getting some Moonblast damage on your Metagross. Yeah. Now I want to Bullet Punch Life Do. Uh, have we seen the speed interaction between these two Metagrosses? I hope mine goes first. Because if so, they can't even get a Bullet Punch off. And if they swap, they just lose a Sash, and Latios is still- Yes, I'm going first. Beautiful. I love that. Okay. And yeah, I could have taken out Latios here, but I'd rather get the life here. I could take out Latios whenever. It's not doing anything. They really want the damage on Metagross, too. Well, too bad, that's not damage. I wonder if they're going for a special defense drop, because they're not going to get it. Alright, healing up. Thank you, Gardevoir. Uh, Reflect is gone. Yikes. <laughs> Don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Close combat could do a ton of damage to Metagross, honestly. Uh, but we Moonblast Metacham. And Bullet Punch Metacham. If you, if you do take out Metagross, you still lose. Latios is struggling. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, poor Latios. Luster Purge only has 8 max PP. It, might, it probably used 8 by now. The screen ran out. And we are faster, so goodbye, Meta Jam. GG's. Whew. Okay, that was a fun one. Not Pelipper. Interesting. Sunny Day scared you that much, huh? Cool. Well, GG. All right, that is a Choice Specs Regice. That is a Sash Lombre with Fake Out and Encore. That's a Hariyama Terra Dark. Does have Protect. Fake Out. Uh, Trick Room Dusclops with Disable Nightshade Will-O-Wisp. Standard Charcoal Torkoal. And Imprisoned Trick Room Chimeco. I know I want Gardevoir on lead, 100%. I also want something that can stop Hariyama from just going for a knockoff into my Gardevoir. Intimidate wouldn't be bad. Draco Meteor, I imagine you might EV to live that, and I don't trust it. I could fake out Raichu lead. Taunt, fake out. I don't hate that. Um, there's other leads they could go with. This, does, this doesn't cover everything, but it's a good start. I mean, I kind of need Metagross to beat Regice, not gonna lie, but also I need Latios or Gyarados to beat Torkoal. Probably Latios, I think. Uh, but Gyarados is good too. But without Terra, using Waterfall. I'm gonna go Latios, Metagross. I don't know if it's right. I don't know. This is scary. This is really, really scary. Whew. Torkoal has been a pain in the past under Trick Room. Orange Steed. Uh, but the person who I fought with Torkoal earlier is currently undefeated. Okay, it is just Mr. Hands and their Trick Room on. Cool. Exerting their pressure, fine. Uh, Hariyama, Terra Dark, Flame Orb. Fake out close combat, protect knockoff. I can fake out that slot. 
and I can taunt Dust Claps. I don't even need to Terra. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Hands instead of Iron Hands, I like it. Uh, they did not go for Taunt. They did not go for Fake Out, I mean. I went for Taunt. They flinch. They try to trick him. Cool. Now, Moonblast is mostly free onto Mr. Hands. Does it KO? I hope so. I could also double that slot. Um, they could swap in... There's a lot of things they could swap in, like Lombre, Regice. Mostly, I can't let Gardevoir die. So I'm going to Moonblast... And Thunderbolt, Mr. Hands. Mr. Hands is swapping. Okay. Who's swapping into this double up? Jotun. Regice. Okay. Free damage on Regice. I like it. It's got good special defense, so this isn't going to do a lot. Oh, but a para. That's sick. Love that. Love that a lot. Not enough to get the KO. gonna be choice specs ice beam probably that's gonna hurt a lot uh, I could life do bring in Metagross Dust Cloud's last turn of taunt I don't want Gardevoir off the field I want a life do and yeah bring in Metagross and they're Terra Ice, too. If they can just KO me, they might even double up. I mean, I have Citrus Fairy, I have Life Dew coming to save me. Got good special defense. They don't Terra, that's good. I don't think they can KO my Gardevoir now. Not this turn. Uh, they don't even try to. They Nightshade over there, try to break the Sash, and throw a raw Blizzard. Insane. Yeah, we would have been able to take a Nightshade, too, anyway. Cool. Uh, what's the Heavy Slam damage into Regice? Metagross, Heavy Slam, Regice, 80 base power. I'm happy with that. Gotta taunt the Ghoul. And Heavy Slam. Yeah. No other play. This is the play 100%. Heavy Slam should be able to pick it up. And like, maybe they read that. Probably they read that and went for a Nightshade. But you might also just go for a Trick Room here anyway. It doesn't put you too far, too much more behind by going for it. Yeah, they did. Michelangelo the social. It's Torkoal time. I think then I Terra Ground Metagross and just Earthquake. Meanwhile, I life do everybody up. Their Torkoal is Terra Fire. Yeah, that's the play. Because Dust Clouds can't willow with me as long as it's taunted. They're probably going to go for a Heat Wave, if I had to guess. That... I mean, that should do a lot of damage. They could even Terra Fire Heat Wave here. That'll do a lot. No Terra. Okay. And I don't think Shadow Ball into Torkoal will do that much. Like, if Shadow Ball plus Earthquake would have taken Torkoal, maybe I should have done that. Yeah, it would have. Darn. Okay. Oh, that because of a crit on Torkoal. Yeah. All right. Nightshade the Metagross and Heatwave, which Gardevoir dies, and Metagross does not get burned from. Cool. Last turn of Taunt. If I KO you, you can then fake out. Thank <laughs> you. 
think I go life, do earthquake anyway. Yeah, I think that's fine. Because now they can fake out Gardevoir, get Trick Room up, but they're so far behind, I don't see them sweeping in Trick Room. Just because they get it with their end have Hariyama. What's the heavy slam damage into a Hariyama? Base 60. Ooh, that's not very much. And Nightshade's gone. Cool. Alright, your taunt is gone. The curse has been lifted. I'm gonna go for the taunt. Because I probably should, anyway. And probably heavy slam the dust claps, or should I just earthquake? Get some spread. I think I want to heavy slam dust claps. I want to just do all my damage that way. That was a lot of damage from fake out, too. Alright, not quite a KO. Fine. Bullet punch might do it. Which would be great. Uh, and their dust claps, trick room willow, nightshade disable. Oh, communication error. All right, we agreed Hariyama wasn't gonna win the four v one, so I took game one. Uh, time to see how they adapt, because the taunt is nice, but a little predictable. But I might have to just do it. I might have to just go and do it. And Raichu, I think, still needs to be the lead. I think I need the same lead. Metagross actually proved to be really good if I save Terra. And having Latios, having Gyarados... I think Latios a little bit better. Gyarados might be able to take a hit. Um... Gyarados, Hariyama's close combat and knockoff. May I could see the argument for Gyarados. Just to take a hit. But Torkoal's definitely coming. So I don't know. The last one's really hard. I want to go Latios. But Gyarados could be the answer too. I don't know. Gyarados at least is neutral from ice moves. That could help. Metagross, though, is so good. As long as I don't have to fight Torkoal and Regice at the same time. Or Hariyama Regice at the same time. I don't know, there's a couple combos that could threaten. Let's see what they go with this time. Torkoal Regice at the same time. Brilliant. gonna do I'm going to bring in Latios and fake out Regice I think <laughs> I think that might work is it gonna be a full-out eruption because that's gonna hurt Regice flinches it's just a heat. Still do still does a lot of hurts. Alright, I can terra fire and blast that red ice. Which I think might be my play. Terra fire, throw the meanest weather ball I have. And also just throw a Thunderbolt over at Torkoal. Ah, oh, Torkoal's swapping. I'm cool with that. 
into dust glasses. Cool. That makes a lot of sense. They're gonna try to get Trick Room up. And if I KO Regice, they might just be able to. If they could bring in Hariyama, fake out Trick Room, then I'm in trouble. Yeah. Well, let's see how much his Weather Ball does first. <laughs> let's not... It's, all, it's always possible they survive and KO Raichu. No, okay. Kinda wish I had Bolt Switch now. That's a good play, bringing Dust Bobs in like that. And here's Mr. Hands. Encore them into fake out if they go after Latios with fake out. So that's what I'm gonna try to get. Yeah, it's a fake out into Latios. Alright, you're locked into that. Good. Mr. Hands is stuck faking out. Latios is not in KO range. 15 damage plus 50 damage. It would be after Life Orb Tick, though. I'm gonna Draco the Hands. Bring in Gardevoir. Yeah, you have to swap that out. Yeah, so I just have to hit this Torkoal, right? <laughs> right? That's all I gotta do, right? I connect Draco. I'm in a really good position. Yeah, Nightshade. Cool. So I'm gonna still have Latios next turn. Beautiful. Goodbye. Whew. All right, the stalling is working a bit. They still got Terra. I only got to take out Mr. Hands. From his Nightshade. So much trick room left. Um, they have a fake out turn if they want it. I don't want to sacrifice Raichu because that can burn a turn. I think I launched launch Draco and Moonblast and I just go for it. Yeah, they're gonna tear us, so I can't. Like, Luster Purge wasn't the play, that's for sure. Moonblast will still work, but I feel like this means they're going to take out Gardevoir. With a mean knockoff. And then hope Nightshade finishes Latios. Yeah, that looks like what they're doing. Uh, no, I think I lose. Oh, what was I supposed to do there? This knockoff is going to just destroy, right? Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't win this now. Huh. Okay. Hmm. I thought I was in a decent spot. I guess not. Alright, right, dude. Right, Cherished, what do you think you can do? They can just protect Mr. Hands and try to burn me. They can protect Mr. Hands and KO Raichu. I don't see anything. I don't see any reason why they wouldn't just try to protect Mr. Hands. Two turns of 
trick room. Hmm, I don't see it. I guess I gotta go for the double into Mr. Hand. Yeah, they're obviously gonna protect. That's a good game. Oh boy. Trick Room is a problem. <laughs> yeah, there's Nightshade and a Raichu. Nothing I can do about that. Still my best move. I'm gonna get knocked off. Probably KOs. But I'm not gonna beat Dusclops one on one anyway. So I'm gonna run this one. That's cancelled. Alright, going to game three. Okay. Torkoal Regice is scary because of what it can do to Gardevoir. Still, I still really need Gardevoir, I just need to get it in at the right times. Gardevoir and... Metagross isn't bad. We've seen what it can do to Torkoal, maybe. Maybe. I might not do enough though, and then I'm screwed. Gardevoir Raichu Metagross. Is it Gyarados this time? Maybe it is. Yes, yeah, something that can take a hit from Hariyama might be it. I don't know if it can take a hit from a Hariyama, not a Terra Dark knockoff hit. Guess we'll see. This is game three of the final round, the round that determines whether I make Top Cut or not. Alright. Yeah, there's Dusclops, cool. Fake out taunt the Dusclops. Easy peasy. Not gonna think too hard. And they're not gonna swap. Cool. Flinched, and they go for Nightshade. Okay. Now I wanna get in Metagross. have to time it. Swap out, swap right back in. Go to Metagross. Get a nuzzle on the red dice, seems fine. Since they're targeting down that slot. Ooh, Focus Blast. Nice. Very cool. Now I can go into Gardevoir real safe, though. And nuzzle up your ghoul. Might want to heal that Metagross later, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Doing the damage. They're doing a lot of damage to Gardevoir. Maybe I should just start knocking out Dusclops. Because like I could taunt it. 
or I could do something better. Just go? Hmm. Yeah. Red Dice swapping, that's cool. Into a Michelangelo. That's the turtle. And I'm just gonna tear it so I can do a powerful Shadow Ball. I wanna start doing damage. I'm done taunting you. I can encore you. Well, that forces you to Nightshade, but like, eh, it's fine. Alright, how much does this even do? It's gotta be a decent chunk. Oh, a very decent chunk. And they can't move because they're paralyzed. Let's go. Alright, they have Terra normal on that. Locked into Nightshade. Uh, I think I'm happy with Shadow Ball, Thunderbolt into the Turtle. Yeah, Ghoul's swapping now. Back into the Reg Ice. Yes, indeed. Oh, they're letting us attack with both. That's great. This might be range. Based on my calcs from previously, this might be range. It's gonna be close. Ah, oh, living on a prayer. And Heat Wave. Mrs. Gardevoir. Let's go. That's huge. That's honestly enormous. Life Dew plus Thunderbolt. Yeah. Goodbye, Torkoal. A big threat to Metagross eliminated. And then life do just to try to keep my Gardevoir alive. And then I like having Gyarados instead of Latios if Red Ice is what they got left. Blizzard, not very accurate. Gardevoir dodges. Raichu, Sayonara. Alright, let's get Metagross in here and try to heal it if we can. were allowed. Uh, it's Mr. Hands. Yeah, we'll be allowed to heal. Um. No, not really. I kind of have to Moonblast over there. Moonblast moon and Heavy Slam seem fine. Yeah, you're going to tear a dart. Try to do big damage with knockoff. Try to not get... Oh, Terra Ice Reg Ice. No, I did not see that coming. That's a cool play. Just send it with blizzards. Ah, uh, but you're protecting? Okay. Uh, I hope Heavy Slam can take you from here. I did get some chip. It does. Good. Goodbye. Oh, and it's a crit. Oh, I don't know if that mattered. Ooh, and now you don't have Terra for your Iron Hand, so I can Psychic Fangs that? Hmm. You just protected. Um, what do they do? They Trick Room and Double Protect with Iron Hands? What do I do? I just obliterate the ghoul because it can't protect and can't Terra. Shadow Ball plus that KOs I'll double up with Psychic Fangs. Yeah. Because then Mr. Hands can only hit one thing at a time. Doesn't KO. Okay. Still fine. Who do you choose to knock out? Gardevoir. That makes sense. That uh, makes a lot of sense. But I 
think we've got the positioning we need. And Sun is gone at the perfect moment. Alright, uh, having Latios in the back would actually be better. Whatever. This is good enough. Oh, am I gonna make Top Cut? I have to keep playing now? Okay. Woo! An Intimidate will help against Gyarados, but Metagross is definitely in KO range anyway. Waterfall. Psychic Fangs should do it. Waterfall does... Oh, so much. Over half. Psychic Fangs clean from there. Yep. Good game. Whew. Tough match. GG's. Very cool team. Alright, welcome to top 32. The Volbeat has no attacks. It has Swagger for presumably the Lumberry Metagross, which does have Protect. Kariyama's Terra Grass, Metagross Terra Water, Melodic Terra Grass, Life Dew, Icy Wind, Skull. Very tanky team, Will-O-Wisp. Okay. They're gonna tank hits. I'm gonna tank hit. Volbeat has Encore. I don't love that. Okay. How do we want to do this then? I mean, Volbeat is vulnerable to fake out. And taunt. Ooh. Taunt fake out lead. I don't hate that. I really like that actually. Taunt and fake out. And then, <laughs> how do we win the game? The Latios has Shadow Ball. Uh, Gyarados can get burned and trigger my Lotic. They just have such a good team. Oh my goodness. Uh, I guess my own Latios is probably fine. Maybe a Sableye? <laughs> I don't know. Latios Metagross? Yeah. I think so. I think that works. Because I shouldn't be that worried about the Dust Clouds because of what I'm bringing. But I'm very worried anyway. Uh, if it's Volbeat, it doesn't have Protect, so I could fake out Taunt. Shutting it down. It has Citrus Berry. Volbeat Latios. Oh, they're gonna go for damage though. They have Shadow Ball, but they have Soul Dew. And they're Terra Steel, as usual. Um, do I care? If they get up Tailwind or whatever, do I care? I need to get rid of that Latios one way or another. Maybe I Moonblast Latios. Encore the Volbeat? Yeah, I don't hate that. Alright, they're just gonna Terra right away. Fine. Terra steal your Latios. See if I care. I care a lot, actually. <laughs> Shadow Ball might just be a two-shot. Eh, would it be a two-shot three? Oh, they're just gonna swagger. Yikes. I don't like that at all. Well, do it again. <laughs> oh, boy. That's scary. And yeah, how much does this Shadow Ball do? over half, but if they don't get a special defense drop, Citrus Berry can save me. Alright, Gardevoir has to swap out. That's just the way it is, because of the drop. And nothing can switch in freely on that anyway. Oh, and I hit myself. Fantastic. Let's start out with some hacks. Alright, uh, let's hacks them back. Let's bring in Metagross, I guess, and introduce Nuzzle to this Latios. You want to play hacks games, we'll play hacks games. Probably going to be a swagger into my Raichu. Yeah. So why swap out when you can just play swagger games like this? Note, they've connected two swaggers now. And a special defense drop from Shadow Ball. But my Raichu's been winning speed ties or is just faster than their Latios. 
Give me a full para to make up for the hit myself. Nope, not that. Okay. Big damage, too. Alright. What's my plan here? Double into Latios? I like it. Heavy slam. Thunderbolt might do it. Full beat swaps, cool. They're not gonna try to tailwind or anything. Well, they can't, and then they start a block down those swagger. Into dust box. If it's a protection Latios, I can encore it. Assuming I can move next turn. But they're not gonna protect. Alright. Thunderbolt. Great damage. Heavy slam. Takes it out. Yes. That's awesome. Alright. Now. We're not winning yet. Do they go trick room mode now? Is that why they never set Tailwind? Here's Metagross. Which cannot Terra, but it can protect. Iron Head, Psychic Fang, Stop and Tantrum. How about a Terra Ground Earthquake? And bring in Latios. I don't want to bring in Gardevoir here. I don't know why. I probably should have brought in Gardevoir here. I maybe even should have swapped my Metagross here, honestly. To start paralyzing these guys with Raichu. That might have been a better play. But I see the Metagross and I want to do damage now. They could easily be slow Metagross too. No, okay. Well, yeah, but, but they're not like gonna protect and set triple. They might just set trick though. But I get big damage on their Metagross first. They're stomping. That's not so bad. They do set trick room. Nightshade, Will O Wisp, Pain Split, Trick Room. They could plain split their own Metagross. That'd be funny, but pointless. They could burn something. They probably would burn something. Um, I could bring in Gardevoir and protect Latios. Do I need to protect Latios? I could bring in Raichu. Yeah, I like bringing in Raichu and just protecting. I mean, it's not like Latios is that threatening. They're probably gonna double this slot. They could just attack twice. They don't need to burn my Metagross. But then they could get a free hit in if they burn my Metagross. I don't know. Nightshade into Latios. Oh, are you doubling that slot maybe? I'd be, I'd be cool with that. Psychic Fangs into the battle. Metagross, Protect, Stomping, Psychic Fangs, Iron Head. Maybe it's a Protect here. So I could bring in Gardevoir. And try to Draco their Metagross. I don't know. It, it, a ris it's a risky play. I don't know. It, it's not perfect. Yeah, Metagross just protected. Fine. Nightshade's not gonna take me. But now someone's gonna take your Metagross. Two turns of Trick Room remain. Iron Head, Metagross could come back in. They're probably stomping though. Uh, against Steel there. I still don't know how I beat their Latios. Might not be able to, if I'm being honest. Well, let's try to get rid of Metagross first. 
type state isn't going to do it. Oh, yes, it is going to do it. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was saying you're not going to be able to take out both of these. Fire your head. Critical hit almost takes me out. In fact, it would take me out if I had connected Dra- Man. Sometimes <laughs> it just be like that. All right, well, we can get out of Trick Room with any two Pokemon. Not any two Pokemon, but two Pokemon. I'm gonna give them Raichu. I'll just protect here. I don't see how I can possibly win this. At all. Nightshade into Latios. Psychic Fangs into Rock. Okay. Uh. Psychic Fangs. Yeah, that probably would have taken out my Metagross. That's, that, that's your strongest move onto it. Okay. So this game is not going great, but we're in a position here to do something. Then we lose, because Latios is going to go down. But I can Earthquake, Master Purge. I'll just try to set Trick Room if I don't KO them. If I do KO them, I lose my Latios to Life Orb. Yeah, I can't win this. Oh well, it's a good game. Uh, here comes, there goes their Metagross. Alright, let's see if I can even take Dust Bounce with this. Oh yeah, and Volbeat's still here. You can't do damage, but Volbeat's also here. Well, special defense job, that's fun. Alright, yeah, I got destroyed. There's nothing I can do. I need to put up screens, I think. I think Sableye would have been big. Volbeat can't touch Sableye. No, you're gonna give me an attack boost? You're gonna risk that? What if Earthquake clears the board and then Bullet Punch takes your Latios? <laughs> I don't think it would. It's at, like, full health, right? Oh, and then I KO myself. That's hilarious. Alright. Swagger games. GG. Let's try to win the next two in a row. I just now realized how close that game actually was. I forgot I had taken out their Latios. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Anyway, let's uh, just try to play better. Let's not bring everything weak to Shadow Ball. Let's sweep with Gyarados, maybe. Gyarados sweeping sounds fun. Yeah, I like that. Let's do that. Gyarados behind screens. Gyarados with Raichu. Gyarados with something to stop Dusclops from burning us. That'd be nice. We could do Sableye, Gyarados, Gardevoir, Metagross. Metagross has two Earthquake partners. We'll put screens up. Raichu didn't do too much for us. Yeah, this might do it. Really depends on leads. In that case, I think I misplayed. Well, Metagross was going to hit itself. No, did I misplay? I don't know. I, I, I still don't think... I don't know. <laughs> it, 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 let's play this game. Play the game in front of you. Yeah, they got Encore on Volbeat. But I could Terra Blast it. It's that light screen. Oh, 
What would they go for? Thunder Wave? That makes sense. Not much I can do about it. But yeah, a light screen. And I'll try to get rid of Volbeat, turn one. They're gonna Terrastalize as well. Is it their Volbeat? They really don't want to lose it? No, it's Lapis. Okay. That's... I guess... Terra Blast and Foul Play were threatening you slightly. If you figure you're gonna Terra that eventually anyway, why not now? That's fine. And I figured I was gonna wanna Terra Gyarados eventually anyway. Uh, if I can take out your Volbeat here, I'd be pretty happy. Sure, I'll trade it for a Thunder Wave onto Gyarados. Yeah, that's exactly what I expected. Okay. Uh, but if you throw something like a Draco into my Sableye, that's not going to KO behind screen. Nor would that KO Gyarados. Just Luster Purge? Okay, just damage the Gyarados, that's your point. Fine. So yeah, I'll trade Volbeat for the Para. And baiting out your Terra, but also mine is gone. Alright. Okay. Paralyzed Gyarados. Not particularly powerful, but can't be burned, which is big. What's Duskbop's gonna do? Is that Trick Room for uh, my Paralyzed Gyarados? That's the awkward thing there. Nightshade, Willow, Pain Split, Trick Room. You could double Gyarados. Draco might pick it up. Hmm, Draco will be iffy. And double the Latios. Luster Purge again into my Gyra. Fine. Foul play. That's some shit. And I get Waterfall. Beautiful. Oh, and a crit by Latios. Crit Magnet Latios. Alright, I like that. Unless they just Trick Room here and then sweep me with a Trick Room Sweeper. Nightshade, fine. Gyarados needed to go anyway. We don't have Terra left. I don't have Terra left either, though. Need to go Gardevoir. They're going Metagross. Alright, foul play into Metagross. Here we go. I can taunt Dusclops and foul play the Metagross. But also, my Sableye might just be slower anyway. So what, did they Iron Head my, sa my Sableye? Foul play into Metagross for sure. Is it worth losing Gardevoir to get a taunt on Dusclops? I think it is. Yeah, I think it is. Metagross just protects. Oh, that's great. No, I don't have to choose. Now I can foul play and bring in my Metagross. You could read that in Stomping, I guess. Did you read this and Nightshade? You were going for Trick Room. That makes sense. That's a good play. That's an understandable play. Foul play your Metagross, bring in my Metagross. I love this Taunt Gardevoir so much. <laughs> Uh, I don't know about Life Dew on it. Maybe Heal Pulse could have been better. I have gotten some use out of Life Dew. Huge damage to Metagross there. Love it. And Iron Head. Nope. No problem. Nightshade. No problem. And we actually go before Metagross with Sableye. That's funny. But yeah. Uh, I bring in Gardevoir. And I Earthquake. Just want to keep them locked out of will o -Wisp. Yep, battle's cancelled. Alright, that's a dub. One more. Alright. Getting rid of Volbeat was brilliant. I would like to do that again. But how this time? Maybe with Raichu Fake Out plus Metagross? I don't hate that. Um, I kind of want Gardevoir in as soon as possible, though. 
Also, Sableye was brilliant. Sableye was fantastic. Sableye performed so well. The question is just, who do I pair it with? Could be Sableye, Gyarados, Raichu? No. Sableye, Gyarados, Gardevoir, Metagross. It worked, it'll work again. That's what I gotta go with. If it worked once, it can work again. And also, they went for that Thunder Wave. And I have a Raichu on my team. It's entirely possible that I brought Raichu this time. They don't know. They don't know for sure. Dusclops Hariyama lead. Oh boy. Uh, getting the Intimidate down on Hariyama's nice, at least. Oh, that change up got me. That's good. That was a good change. Their Terra Grass on Hariyama. Reflect and bring in Gardevoir. Just so I don't get burned. I can also Reflect, Attack, then bring in Gardevoir. No, Reflect, bring in Gardevoir is better. Because with their Intimidate, which is pretty good, maybe Gardevoir can even heal up. Maybe I can bring in Gyarados again for another Intimidate. Keep them from doing too much damage. It's like they're burned, but like, what do they got? Knock off? No, they're not burned, they're Assault Fest. What do they got? They got knockoff with no burn okay happy to foul play and moonblast even foul play will do twice as much if you terra there goes dusclops into metagross i assume yeah it would have been nice to catch that on the other side but with reflect up and my, my intimidate down on Nariyama, mm, that's not doing much damage we're gonna punish we're gonna hit that thing hard. Oh, that did nothing. <laughs> Never mind, you're just super bulky. Yeah, alright. Like your Metagross, it has Psychic Fangs. Do you make that call into Gardevoir? That I'm gonna bring in Gyarados here? You also probably Terra Water it. I could foul play your Metagross. Do you make that call? I'm gonna bring in Gyarados. If you call it, good call. Because I could have also brought in Metagross there. Um, yeah, the Intimidate did cancel a little bit of the foul play damage onto Hariyama, but that was. I didn't expect it to do damage unless it terrestrialized into grass. Uh, Metagross go on Terra Water. I should do a little less than half the foul play. They don't get intimidated. But they are worried about foul play. Understand. Alright, let's see what you did. Knock off into Sableye. That's fine. I already have my Reflect up. Great. Iron Head into Sableye. Okay, that was almost a call. Foul play does about a third. Okay. Two turns of Trick Room. Foul play. I could Dragon Dance this turn. Psychic Fangs would hurt. I think I'm ready to foul play Terra Blast. And still, I'm very unafraid of Harikama. Metagross going away would be wonderful. Because that's also their Terra. A knockoff and Disable Eye again, whatever. Iron Head and Disable Eye again, whatever. Yeah, they did not expect Gyarados to attack. That's awesome. Oh, crit from Sableye. 
I would have expected a crit plus a regular one to KO, but they're just bulky, huh? Goodbye, Metagross. Guess I could have waterfall. Oh well. Now I would like to get Gardevoir back in so they can't set another Trick Room. Because they're on the last turn of Trick Room. Uh, if they bring in Latios or something else fast. Yeah, there's Latios, then I can just Terra Blast at the Hariyama. Um, I could bring it, I could put up Light Screen and swap. Could dragon dance and so on. Bring in Gardevoir. Dragon dance. This is the last turn of Trick Room. Um, might even be better to light screen, though, than dragon dance. Yeah, I like that. They do swap Hariyama and Dust Pops. So they're gonna get another Trick Room if they want it. really important to note whether or not Latios is going for Protect here, because it's kind of the target. It does, yes! That's huge. This turn I can take a KO on your right slot. Then bringing Gardevoir, like you'll get Trick Room up, which and you probably want me to take out Latios here. I should have considered not taking out Latios at all, just hitting Dust Clops and then leaving you on the field. But with Latios actually being slower than my Gyarados, it's better to take it out. Goodbye, Latios. I can Protect Taunt. Oh, they have a Fake Out turn. So they don't set up Trick Room, they just Willow. Yo. But with your Hariyama being AV, I can just double into it, and one of the hits will take it out. And then you just have Dusclops V World. You can't win with Dusclops V World. Moonblast. Or Terra Blast. Pick your poison. You like Terra Blast. Okay, me too. Plus one burn Terra Blast? Plenty. No question. Goodbye, Hariyama. Hello, top 16, probably. They do trick. Right, they got Paint Split and Nightshade. Eh, that could be annoying. I guess I should taunt them so they can't heal. And I should Dragon Dance so I can do more damage. Yeah, they're not winning this. I can... After I taunt them, all they have can do is Nightshade. I can Life Do when uh, Trick Room ends. Because I'm going to get Gardevoir out here so I can come back later and Life Do. Probably could have just Life do there. Left and light screen no longer matter. Bring in Sableye as a sacrifice and go for Terra Blast. They're still playing it. They don't know it's over. Nightshade, take up my Sableye. Okay. See how much this Terra Blast can do. Not a whole lot, honestly. Light screen is gone. <laughs> yeah, I guess I go Metagross and they try to burn it. Two turns of Trick Room. 
do I let them burn it? I'm gonna Dragon Dance again. Alright, they just go for Nightshade into Metagross. They're not trying to burn. Heavy Slam does a lot of damage. Awesome. Okay. Now, Trick Room is about to end. I can give them Gardevoir if they want a Nightshade there. Otherwise, if they don't do that, I get Gardevoir in and I can then Life do for the end game. Bring in Gardevoir. Might as well Terra Blast, right? Yeah. Well, yeah, of course, they're taunted. They have to Nightshade. Ha! <laughs> I'm silly. This game's just gone on much longer than it ought to. And Gardevoir is gone. And hopefully this Terra Blast should finally finish the game. Oh. Thank you. Oh, a crit. Thank you. Finally. Alright. I'm in top 16. Let's go. Alright. Versus Pangi. Top 16. That's Weezing Gigas. That's Silk Scarf. Four attacks. Ga uh, oh, Slay King, not Gigas. Uh, Gunk Shot, Willow, Taunt, Protect, Citrus, Dark. Normal Slaking, Iron Defense, Metagross, Terra Ghost, uh, Soul Dew Latios with Thunder, and Dragon Pulse. Uh, Terra Fairy, interesting. Weather Ball, Ice Beam, Leaf Storm, Protect, Terra Steel, Life Orb, Ludicolo, and Drizzle, Focus Sash, Standard, Terra Ghost, Pelipper. So Fake Out isn't the best lead, but it could work against Slaking. But against the Rain, Setting Up Sun isn't that great. Setting Up Light Screen is. But then, against Slay King, Sableye kind of not great. Because <laughs> Weezing can cause big problems. Uh, but I guess I could Sableye Raichu fake out the Weezing foul play. Or I could Sableye Raichu to start throwing electric moves. Or just get Light Screen up. But getting Light Screen up and bringing in Metagross is great. And then finally, Iron Defense Metagross. I guess Latios is good against pretty much everything here. There's nothing wrong with Latios here. I like it. Terra Steel Ludicolo. Pelipper does not have wide guard, so I can Earthquake freely. Let's see. Uh, really depends what they bring. Are they gonna go rain seeing my son? Latios Metagross. That's an Iron Defense set and a Soul Dew with Thunder set. Because they don't have Draco, they can't Oko my Sableye, but they could double into my Sableye. I could Light Screen and try to fake out Metagross. Oh, I really want to Foul Play. I want to Foul Play the Metagross. Fake out Latios. Yeah, that's fine. Right, we get the fake out. What do they go for? Iron defense? Because I can encore that. Just heavy slam. Sableye eats. Eat this foul play. You probably will. Oh, you're super tanky. Okay. Good to know. Extreme tankiness. Gotcha. I think I'd rather have Light Screen than Reflect. So I'll Light Screen. And I think I want to Thunderbolt the Metagross. It just protects. Well, your Encore food. Because I Light Screen, I mean, you're not going to be able to Thunder, obviously. Go for it, actually. I'd, I'd love that. Uh, Dragon Quest that probably doesn't do it. It might. Oh, a crit. Yeah, it does. With a crit. Of course, with a crit. What? <laughs> Obviously, they were gonna crit. Should have known that. Heavy slam into their Latio slot is so free that I almost don't want to do it. So I can encore their Metagross and heavy slam their Latios, and they can hit my Raichu back. 
I mean, if they wanna. Uh, they can also swap either Mon they want. Uh, I'm gonna Heavy Slam Latios. I'm gonna Encore Metagross. See if they're gonna fall for that, or if they're gonna swap in Pelipper and something. I mean, hitting Pelipper isn't bad. It has a Sash. Also, go ahead and bring in Pelipper while I have Raichu on the field. That sounds fun. That sounds really fun, especially once your Sash is gone. So yeah, I don't think I'm in a bad position here. Very Latios. You so badly want to bring in Pelipper and Thunder, but Raichu's telling you you can't. <laughs> eh, it's not like a Soul Dew Thunder is going to take an AV Metagross anyway. Alright, they swap Metagross. Should have seen that coming. Into Slaking. Cool. I'm paralyzing you later. Encore fails, of course. And they just break Raichu's set. Well, probably bring me down to that, honestly. Mm, no, not as much as I thought. Heavy Slam finishes Latios. Great. Alright, they have Body Slam, EQ, Sucker Punch, Giga Impact. That's scary. Um, I could throw an Earthquake of my own and bring in Latios. I could paralyze them and go for Psychic Fangs. I think I go Terra Ground EQ, swap to Latios. Man, I really wish I had Volt Switch on this Raichu. An earlier draft did. The combos I could pull off would be amazing. Uh, but I guess Sucker Punch could take out Raichu there. Potentially. And yes, I am hitting my own Latios. I understand how that works. The the wheezing is making Levitate go away. And they're gonna Terra. Presumably the Weezing. Yep. Into dark. Well, here's hoping I made the right play. I'm not 100% confident. They earthquake themselves. <laughs> I'm earthquaking too. Let's all earthquake this Latios. Latios loves getting hit by earthquakes. <laughs> Bye, Latios. I'm sorry. Uh, then a burn here, and then that's game, right? Oh, Citrus Berry first. And burn, that's probably game, yeah. Um, I guess I could lock the Slay King, I guess I could Thunderbolt the Weezing, maybe. At minimum, I can fake out Slay King here for free. What does that do? Metagross and Hundred base power heavy slam. That is my best move onto it. Heavy slam. Fake out. Oh, they swapped the Slay King. Okay, cool play. Uh, but Weezing just protected. So I don't know. I don't know if they're trying to just play careful so they guarantee the win, or what's going on here. But that Weezing has to swap. Metagross is free to do whatever it wants, though. Which would be, what, Body Press? Heavy Slam? Doubling into Weezing here is my play. 
it's not over over, but this one's pretty over. I'm not gonna give up. Where there's a nuzzle, there's a way. Maybe I should have just thrown a nuzzle because that's my win con. Is paras. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, they let me get the double into wheezing, it looks like. Let me see speed tiers here. Oh, never mind. Para the wheezing. My Metagross is faster than their Metagross. That's good to know. Every Metagross I've faced, I've been faster than. I'm not even very speed invested. Just does no one put speed on Metagross? Gas wears off, that doesn't matter. Body press into right, change the right play. Okay. Giga Impact, and Body Slam finishes the game. Yeah, honestly, Body Slam should finish the game, I think. Silk Scarf Body Slam from here. They don't have Terra anymore. But this is definitely a winnable game. Not this one. The set itself is winnable. Let's see how much Body Slam does. 103 down to 9. Okay. Alright, Metagross, get a Super Ultra Mega Crit! And take them both out! Ooh, so close! <laughs> and they iron defense because they're funny. Alright. I was hoping they would go for Giga Impact. In fact, I want them to go for Giga Impact. Go for Giga Impact here. Do it. Wait, no, do I. Oh no, I go down to burn anyway! No! Okay, I guess they were confident Body Slam does it. Well, it did do it. Alrighty. On to game two. Alright, let's try this again. And let's do it right this time. Whatever that means. Uh, it means Latios not going down. Maybe Latios shouldn't come. No, Latios should come. Maybe I should have sacked Raichu? I'm not sure. Metagross seems good, but maybe isn't. Sableye is great. I'm doing Sableye first. Maybe Sableye Raichu? Maybe I should rely more on Paras? Could also be Sableye Gyarados. As long as they don't lead Weezing. They do lead Weezing, Gigas. Weezing, Slay King. I'd be in a lot of trouble, though. Um... Maybe that's a risk I have to take. I mean, they also have Thunder on Latios, so maybe Gyarados isn't the play. Raichu, Metagross. Latios? I do think Latios is pretty good. I don't hate Gardevoir either, but I don't love it. Yeah, I'm gonna go with these four. I think they're the right four. I do think they're the right four, even seeing what happened in game one. Just have to... Well, I gotta get calls right. And I gotta win. Uh, of course, we gotta win. Alright, they play really well too. So I gotta be careful. I mean, we're in top 16, of course they play well. Latios Metagross, okay. I'm gonna fake out Metagross this time and start with Light Spring. They don't want to protect in front of me. So I get the fake out. I get the light screen. Now I can also get reflect. Don't crit me this time. Okay. I did so much damage. Wow. Right, if I don't get damage on Metagross with foul play, what am I going to do? Uh... Sunny day and then use Weather Ball. I don't hate that. Sunny day. Nuzzle their Latios. I kind of like that. Let's get this sun out here. Hopefully, he didn't bring rain in the back. Okay, 
Luster Purge my Raichu. I wonder if it's a double into Raichu. Psychic Fangs? You got Psychic Fangs, right? No, you don't got Psychic Fangs. Heavy Slam, Body Press. Yep, Body Press. Cool. That means I get Reflect, too, if I want it. Probably don't. I'm happy to go to Latios here. And Blaster Metagross wide open. Do I Terra Weather Ball? Probably. Their Latios is Fairy Terra. I don't want to take that out just yet. I think I do want to put up Reflect here. Terra Fire Weather Ball their Metagross. Yeah, I think that's a fine play. It's doubly fine if they have Weezing Slaking in the back again. Which, why would you change what works? They could Terra Ghost here. Still vulnerable to foul play then. And they lose their Terra. And I mean, this is gonna do damage. They do Terra. Is it Latios or is it Metagross? Because I'm threatening both. Latios, okay. Then I wonder if you're protecting Metagross. Because if not, I can blow it up, which is great. Yeah, alright. Get my Reflect for your Slay King in the back. Launch a Weather Ball, let's go. Get out of here, Metagross. Boom. Oh, that feels so nice. Okay. Uh, now I gotta see what this thing does. Does it finish off my save line? Does it throw a thunder? Does it get paralyzed? Yeah, it gets paralyzed! Weezing cannot Terra now, which is pretty big. There's Slaking. Which can Earthquake? I could foul play it, of course. I could double into it, it's free. I think I'll foul play just to get the chip first and protect my Latios. They just try to take out Sableye, I get Metagross in. Um, I could still very easily lose this. Giga Impact! Wow, they do not like Latios. And they're fully paralyzed again, yes! Oh, that's huge, actually. Foul Play does so much damage. That's Luster Purge range for sure. I'm gonna bring in Metagross and Luster Purge. Get rid of Slaking. Okay. This could be really, really good. Uh, what do you do? You throw a Sucker Punch? Okay, you swap. Weezing? Giving me Weezing? Yeah. I'll take Weezing. Thank you. Those Paras were big because Dragon Pulse probably finishes Sableye, but then I don't get the foul play. So I gotta admit, that Para was huge. Here's my Luster Perch because I knew you were only swapping with Weezing. Goodbye. Without gas, as long as I have Latios left, I can protect on that Slay King every- <laughs> Another full para! Oh, poor Latios. Poor thing. Oh yeah, I'll just Luster Perch to finish off Slay King, Heavy Slam to finish off Latios. And Weather Balls more. Battle's cancelled. Alright. Alright, that's a dub. Just need one more dub. Let's do it. Alright, I'm confident I have the right four. So I'm gonna lock them in. But I'm gonna think. Do they not bring Slay King this time? Because Slay King, honestly, isn't that good. It may have gotten lucky. Metagross is so good against their Latios. Do they even bring rain? Do they just switch out from bring rain? Do they just say, hey, Time for rain? 
because, I mean, I have Sunny Day Sableye. I can mess up your rain plans. I don't know. It's a tough one. Let's do it. Let's do game three. I'm really happy with how far I've made it so far. So if I do lose here, still. It's been so fun. Um, can I afford Terra on Sableye? No, not really. I think I want to go reflect. Fake out lot Yeah. Just to do things a little differently every time. Keep them on their toes. Body press. Interesting play. I'm gonna go for light screen now. Play now. Now they could double me. That'd be a problem. Light screen. Bring in my Metagross now. Save Raichu for later. Alright, Metagross, welcome to the field. Gladios protects in front of my Raichu. Crazy. Now you can't protect next turn. Heavy Slam coming your way. Body crush. Nothing. Alright. Foul play is pretty free. If they bring in Weezing, oh well. Heavy Slam Latios. Yeah, this is nice. Can't get around foul play. You could Iron Defense now. That might be your best play. But you have to worry about my Latios in the back still. If I have her set up Sun. Which I probably should do sooner than later. Uh, Ladio swaps. Heavy Slam's good into everything, unless you brought rain this time. You did not. Okay. That's 100 power in the Slay King. I'll take it. Almost half. Beautiful. And they do go for Iron Defense. That's pretty scary. Uh, they're not going to want to swap Metagross out. They're just going to throw a hit with Slay King. And honestly, get foul played. Like, okay. Do I give them Raichu? They need Metagross for Ladia, so I can't risk Metagross here. Though, Metagross might be able to take everything anyway. Else is important for the weather ball, yeah. And I'll bring in Raichu. I don't think I have to swap Metagross here, but we'll see. And if they don't take Raichu, I've got a fake out turn, I've got potential for Encore. Metagross protects, I've got huge potential for Encore if they don't take out Raichu. But it's really quick, they're gonna take out Raichu. Okay. That's a reasonable play. I'll take Slaking, thanks. Uh, they could have Weezing in the back, which is annoying for everything. Slaking's got a Truant turn coming up, too. Metagross could finish it off with Bullet Punch if I wanted. Bring in Latios. I'm gonna show them the Weather Ball play. And then I'm not gonna click it. Foul play the Slay King Protect. You see the Weather Ball play. You see the Sunny Day Terrifier Weather Ball destroy Metagross. You see it. So you take out your plus two defense Metagross. That's my call. It's bold. It's quite a bold call here. 
but it's my call. You don't want your Slay King's Truant turn to be also the turn Metagross gets blown up. Slay King slot. Just into Weezing, okay. I guess that's not the ba that bad. Heavy slam into my Latia. Fine. And just a little bit of foul play chip into the Weezing. Yeah, that's a good amount of foul play chip into the Weezing. Alright, they don't want me to set Sunny Day. They're going to taunt my Sableye. Which can pretty easily become a Metagross. But I also don't want to get Will-O-Wisp, so I'm going to go ahead and... Still have Terra. They gotta burn Terra on Weezing if they want to stop the sun. Come on, don't Terra Dark your Weezing. Okay. It might be. No, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm tearing my Latios defensively for the Metagross's Heavy Slam. Since I'm leaving myself pretty open to that. I'm trying to set Sunny Day for next turn. Oh, they Terra! Oh, they did it. That's really bad. If they Terra and Taunted, that's so bad. That could not be worse if that's what they do. Maybe I can outspeed their wheezing? There's Heavy Slam, I got that call right at least. Gunk Shot! We take that. We get poisoned, but we get the sun. Now they can double into Latios here. Or just double protect. So bringing in Metagross is pretty easy. But then what? Hmm. Yeah, this is hard. That poison is gonna be a big problem. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I can win this because of the poison. I don't have enough hits left in Latios. Plus my life orb tick. I think Latios has to be the one to take out Metagross. Who protects? Okay, got that right at least. Do you make the amazing read and burn on the switch? No, just double protect. Fine. Try to take out Weezing, right? What else is there to do? Foul play? Heavy slam? Seems like the way. Can't just bring in Latios because it's such a risk and then they just I take a tick of poison and then they protect and then Yeah, I don't think Latios wins. I think I think I lost because of that poison. Without the poison it could have gone either way. Ooh, such good damage. If that had just picked up, we would be back in it. Plus I'm in Sucker Punch range. Oh! Iron Defense with the Metagross again. Will-O-Wisp dodge by my Sableye. Okay. Pretty good, pretty good. Don't hate that. I do hate the Iron Defense Metagross. That's gonna be nearly impossible to break because I don't have Will-O-Wisp. Oh, my Reflect is gone. That's bad, that's bad. That's really bad. Body press my Metagross here. Maybe they protect their Weezing. 
Gotta put reflect back up. Don't need light screen anymore. Could always crit an earthquake on their Metagross. So I'm gonna go with that. Weezing might protect. Yeah, Weezing did protect. Fine. Sableye, this is gonna hurt a little bit. You'll live though. Hopefully I crit their Metagross. I do not. They body press. Doing a ton to my Metagross. But I get Reflex back though. Alright. Now I can Heavy Slam the Weezing. And then... What? Foul play? Hope for a crit on Metagross? Critting Metagross is a good win con. Uh, but I don't think I have the juice anymore. <laughs> All my mods are so low. I need stuff to happen now. And it's not happening. <sighs> good game. Does that day get the double on Weezing? Incredible. Okay, well, if you can get a double protect, I can get a crit, right? Fair is fair. Crit is way lower odds than a double protect. Right? Heavy slam into Sableye. We live. Hold up. Hold up. Crit. No. Sun is gone. As is any chance of Sableye helping me beat this metal. They're gonna heavy slam the Sableye. And I guess give me Weezing slot, right? my win condition. I don't see one. No way they let Sableye get a move off. Maybe they do. Weezing goes for a triple protect. I have no reason not to. Maybe they want to take out my Metagross here more than my Sableye? That seems weird. Because now Latios can come in and like, what, Thunder? Eh, they probably can't take out my Metagross. Gas wears off. I've been playing into Sableye yet. Okay. Latios is almost gone. All I have left is the hope of a crit on Metagross, which probably doesn't do enough. Put a double up and a crit. <laughs> uh, here's Slay King with Sucker Punch. They just do that to lock down my... anything, really. Sucker Punch is guaranteed on my Metagross, so they just go for it. Nothing I can do about it. So a Draco crit, if that's enough to take Metagross, we got a shot, right? And then if they sucker punch my Latios instead, I should Earthquake. They did sucker punch Latios instead, okay. Uh, I need to crit Metagross and crit to KO. That's not gonna happen. So good game. Ooh, I've had a good run. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Let's see, how much does this do? No crit. Alright, GG. I assume this is a body press. I will go ahead and report this loss. Yep, that's it. G to the G's. Alright, there's the end of my run. It's been fun. Losing to Pengi in top 16? I'll take it. I did pretty good. We are back. I ended up top 16, which I'm happy with. Uh, I guess I probably could have gone a little further. I think I played well in that last. Pengi played well, too. It was just a great final match. Uh, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed. If you made it this far, definitely leave a like on this video and sub to my channel. Uh, if you haven't already, it, that is. Uh, but anyways, I'm Jordy. And, uh, alright. Peace.